dollars sent home from the diaspora by your loved ones represents their hard work and commitment to ensuring that you're all taken care of. That's why we want to ease their experience and make it more convenient. With Sasai Money Transfer, sending money from the diaspora is free and you receive the money straight into your EcoCash USD wallet, ready for you to spend and cash out for free. That way, you can receive money to help you alleviate the impact of the drought on you and your family. Buy groceries, pay school fees, renew your insurance, pay bills and more within a few taps on your phone. And you're guaranteed access to USD cash from any registered EcoCash outlet nationwide. Tell your family in the diaspora to send money with Sasai Money Transfer today. Let's fight the El Nino-induced drought together. EcoCash. Live life the EcoCash way. The views expressed by our guests in the following video are solely the opinions of our guests and do not necessarily reflect the views and or opinions of the Ola 7 podcast show. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello guys, my name is DJ Ola7 Owen. We are Madondo here on the Ola7 podcast show on the spot. I love this segment and guess what? We are coming to you all the way from South Africa. Miri kwa limpopo ndo kwatiri right now. Uh, and um, uh, uh, to be specific, Trimu no mnu dimu run back or oh, close to like not riding. <laughs> That's where we are. <laughs> and uh, you know on this uh, program tonight uh, we've got a uh, a very, you know, uh, talented, super talented artist, you know, as Zim Danzo artist. His name is um, uh, uh, Buffalo Soldier. I'm sure the name is very familiar. And this guy, you know, when I was on radio, you know, I was like, okay, okay. First time listening to his music, I was like, who's this guy? Are you telling me that this guy is Zimbo? Because of the, you know, the international feel yeah. that's, you know, he, that, that he fuses in his music. So uh, he's here to tell us more about himself. My brother, Buffalo Soldier, it's a pleasure, my guy. What's good? What's good? Uh, you know, super, super califragilistic. I tell you, Cali, uh, super califragilistic. <laughs> <extra> delicious. <laughs> the guy is dropping some bars here. <laughs> yeah, but I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Brother. Finally, man. You know. Yeah. Otherwise, Finally, good. Yeah, I'm good. Man. Yeah, yeah. I, I understand you. Uh, you know, king of dancehall, king of dancehall. Buffalo Soldier. That's what was going to be tied. Exactly, the king of dancer. <laughs> African dancer. African dancer. So it's yeah. not king of Zim dancer, it's king of uh, African dancer. It will be the, the title of king, king of African, African um, dancer. Mm -hmm. uh, for me, the, the, you know, like I said, you know, we've always been, it was always bouncing around Africa. Yes. You know, it was not about um, just only Zim mm -hmm. and, and, and uh, claiming uh, uh, just a country. Mm -hmm. It was always because of the mainstream that we got what we were receiving. Yes, yes. So became king of African dance. Mm, that's 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 powerful. Yeah, and most people always say that it's self acclaimed, but it's not <laughs> self <-acclaimed. laughs> <laughs> 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 you know, Who crowned you? So basically, what used to happen, right, is um, I've won I've won the African reggae dancer category mm -hmm. uh, in Africa for more than ten years. Okay. Consecutive. Mm. So one time we were in um, in Nigeria, Sound City, uh -huh. Sound City, uh -huh. and I was nominated there. Chatawale, all those guys. Yes, and yes. And I still won it. Mm. So when I won that that award from there, the, the title, title started, started coming, coming from, from there. Ah, you know, this king of African dance. dance yes, world. yes. Ah, so, so now, you know, it makes you humble. You be humble. Exactly. You know, you know, just, <laughs> yeah. you know, I'm the king. Because, you know, as Africans, right? If you, if you check up something, if you own up to something, yeah. like, yo, this is the title. Then it, it's always mistaken for yes. you know, being braggadocious. Yes. You know? But... You just accepting your title because mm -hmm. I, I don't think with Mario you, you are the president. But ah, I'm the president. Why, why are you putting yourself president? Because <laughs> the title that has come throughout the years, you know. So yeah. certain people might not accept, but that was a title. That yeah. Was so there you have it, guys. <laughs> the king of African dance hall. Yeah. Not just Zim dance, but African dance hall. So that yeah. includes that. I mean, Zimbabwe included there. <laughs> but, but you see, but that one, but that one, you know, obviously when it comes to to, to Zim, you know, there's um. It will always be an issue, you know. I mean, my brother Winky D is yes. um, somebody who's always 
who's run with yeah. dancer exactly a zim dancer mm -hmm. also he, he doesn't even title himself as, uh -huh. as a zim dancer like he just started himself as a dancer that's what that is yeah and basically sometimes even as a musician mm -hmm. so you'd find out it's always it's always tricky and sensitive mm. to the fans. Mm. Oh yeah. It's never like you know uh, sensitive because you see how how for example how me and Winky mm -hmm. would address this. Winky would always say, "Ah, but you know, how Africa is a more book." Exactly. You know, ah, but Zim, you know, Zagamira. So, Zagamira. So, so, mm -hmm. Which is the reason why we had to do this collaboration. Mm. I mean, they are with an arm, an arugare, and so forth. Exactly. So you know, what, okay. You mean I'm stronger in this market. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's let's see let's introduce let's introduce let's bridge the gap exactly in what you have Same and said Gwako, and you know, Africa was, like I'm say. exactly and so, so, so that's what we uh, we started working together mm. so, which is what um, a lot of artists need to do in terms of just bridging the gap exactly and and, and what's your relationship like with uh, with Winky oh it's good man ah, I mean man, Winky is, is good I think uh, I'm probably the only one that he invited to his house wow most of the artists exactly <laughs> you know, really. but uh, me and him have uh, always been good. Mm -hmm. From the first, first time we met, we met a long time ago, mm. you know, the first, first time we... Uh, wow. But it was just, uh, yo, you know, we were finding common ground in terms of, you know, workmanship, in terms of if we're going to, the collaboration, the music. Yes. Because, like, you know, Wink is also a very calculative yes. artist. Yes, yes. Takes his time and his craft, you know. Mm -hmm. So it was always, um, when we get, when we find that song, when we find that, you know, mm -hmm. then, you know what I mean, the yeah. energy has to be right, everything yes. has to be right, yes. you know. So... My enemy is always good, man. We speak on WhatsApp. We laugh at so many other things that mm. we don't know. And, and exactly. Stuff, because it's, <laughs> it's one of those things where you can even laugh, mm -hmm. uh, laugh at, at, at the fans. Because remember the fans and, and people that comment, is, 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 you know, they have their own opinion. And, oh, yeah. And you must understand that my fans, I find out that I'm in Manchester. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, my city. You know, Lango Magazine. You know, the day, the time when you, you could actually see uh, Ronaldo and Messi in, in one picture. Yeah, like, ah, but Messi, Lango, Ronaldo. <laughs> exactly. You know, yeah. but it's always been like that. You know. It's yeah, like, and, uh, and and how did you, you know, come up with that song, Rugari? It's a very beautiful song. You know, so, I love the song. And um, how long did it take you to, to produce that so, song? So, so with Rugari, right, I'll tell you the the Rugari. What happened is like I sent Winky an idea of. Of a rugare uh, singing about a girl. Mm -hmm. That you know, non dipa rugare, non dipa rugare, exactly. so, something like that, you know. And then I sent to, to Winky, and Winky's like, I know, I'll come back to you. Yeah. Then after a while, I think that that's true, but tell me, I don't buy it. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know, 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 I don't Rugare, rud. Exactly, exactly, exactly. <laughs> um, so he, he then called, uh, he then came here, we came here, mm -hmm. um, recorded the stuff, and shot the video, right? Mm. So that same, that, same, that same weekend, we did the recording, and then we shot the video. Mm -hmm. and then, but it was because of, it was an exchange of, my ideas are just that we exchange, when we just link up, mm -hmm. oh. you just take it out, yeah. Powerful. You know, uh, I'm talking here to uh, my brother, Buffalo yeah. Soldier. Yeah. Uh, what so you recently posted a picture, you know, I saw the picture uh, with a very uh, curvy lady and uh, you captioned it, um, I, and I caught, you said, big man thing, mahombe konde. You know, mahombe konde. Mahombe konde, go to So, but I want to understand, my brother, what are you trying to say? Dimur kujigere, is it? Or what? appreciate that, that you appreciate that. Because well. <laughs> I like that well. statement. <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, you know, Africa, uh, uh, the, the, the blessings from God. You know, you know. Yeah. You know, it's a. Uh, you know what I mean? Those cup charges. Yes, yes. If you're going in there, it's a big thing. You know what I mean? I don't appreciate it. If you're going in there, Interesting. But but, but how, how do you manage it? You know, say it's like a boss, if you're a big star, yeah. like, like you are, my brother, you know, and yeah. uh, sometimes women just throw themselves, yes. you know, kamuri. I know, you know what, you know. You see, you know, you see this is, for, for me, this is, has always been the, the, the I always said in the, the meeting. When, 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 when I came from, when I came to SA, I came with the chicken bus. Hey. So my mission was always, I don't want music. I need to go and make music. If I think back, 
Gosto muito de vídeo, né? Eu quero me livrar de vídeo. Ou vai pedir pra você. Ah, não vou fazer isso. Eu 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 vou fazer isso. You know, record companies, you sign with a record company. Oh, we just have to be signed Exactly, yeah. You know, you had to be signed by a record company. You know, this company, you know, a structure. Yeah. So, I know that you are going to be, ah, it's my job, you know. My mission had always been, I want to understand it. Exactly. And you visit it, you know, you're on my guitar. Because even when I got to the radio, like, you know, you didn't want to see straight. Mm-hmm. And I said, ah, if you date a South African girl for maybe and she has a boyfriend and the guy will shoot you there was a lot of killings that used to happen in here bro guys being thrown off the eighth floor I know one even one guy that was thrown was found with somebody's girlfriend it's different from now where guys can take people's girlfriends and you know back in the days if you take Yeah, South Africa. Yeah, I don't know that than before. You know, I mean, I know there's a lot of crimes, robberies, and whatever. But I'm talking about this person that would date somebody's girlfriend. It was not like how it was. So you were warned before. Say, hey, be very careful. I was warned. Yeah, and that helped me for me to just like let me just keep away. Yeah, yeah. You know, and if if I scrutinize you, you know, then I don't know that way. Exactly. But I've always been very careful and you know skeptic in terms of who. So are you married now? No, I'm not married. You're not married. Wow, but you're looking forward to it. Yeah, I know. Looking forward. I mean, I look. I mean, it's kind of well, when I'm not there, you know. I always say like it's it's a it's it's you know one has to be. I know it's still nowadays it's like television. I think think of a soul man. Yeah, but when I'm on stage, I mean, it's a vibe. I understand the feel, you know, and so forth. We'll see what we do. For me, I'm I'm open, open minded. I mean, I have to date. I'm not going to. I don't. I don't enslave. Yeah, I don't, I don't believe, believe in Muskana can be free, you know. <laughs> I believe that she, she can also be her own person. Mm -hmm. She can, if she, she wants, wants to be on social media and post whatever she wants to post. Exactly. Right? I, I think, think when it comes to that, I'm a bit. Uh, I go. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not in the same page with Shadai in terms of how I see women. I just just be free, man. And you let them be. So you would allow your girlfriend to post maybe some something like half naked. Yeah. Do you mind? Mind him. You could be a bikini model. I mean, you could be. For example, if I'm gonna, if I date a model, who's a bikini model, who's a model, she could literally just throw the nap. Yeah, sure. Imagine if you date someone like how you did like a Naomi Campbell in a prime. You know, you you bound to date someone who's. So for me, I don't really have because I always like okay, if if I meet up meet someone who's 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 an artist, maybe she's a celebrity, yeah, or I meet somebody who's um. Um, a model or an actor, actor. Mm -hmm. you, you know, know, for example, you know, I don't know if you watch this movie called, uh, was it Ball or something? Yeah, about, about, uh, oh yes, uh, Haley Berry. Mm -hmm. Eight boys, yeah, Haley yeah. Berry, and you find out how it was almost like a sex war, you know what I mean? And that's your wife. So I'm, I'm not, not gonna be, you know, know what I mean? Yeah, look at that, the new series, you know, the new movie with Kelly Rowling and, you know, on Netflix. You know, it was a. You know, there's sex season, season but it's me. So for, for me, it's like, like I feel like you, you know, we we, we kind of also have to uh, um, understand. Mm. The, you know, we all humans. Yeah. For me, I'm, I'm not, not trying, trying to control anybody in terms of uh, you know, I mean, to be uh, typically African when it comes to that part. Cultural men, I'm you know, I'm a traditional man, but I also believe that you know the. I'm not going to enslave any human being. I don't have power. That's that's God. That has everything to do with it. I would not play God over... So when it comes to to dating, you don't mind even dating a celebrity or let's say, let me say, okay, someone with the dirty past. No, 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 no. So, the dirty past, for me, that's something because I always say, right, I know that we can't equalize men and women, Yeah. but I always say, like, you know, men is the worst... Past. Yeah. Every, every man that you see, most every man, I'll tell you, ninety percent of men have the worst, worst past. Mm. So what do we get? What do we get the past? past what do we get the past of uh, only men? And you know, a man you find a man just in the past, his body count was probably like a thousand, whatever. But then, yeah, but when 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 I need my partner, my partner must be a virgin, must be 
you know what I mean? I feel like we should find some common ground. Okay, okay, I think I body down to give them maybe kind of change. You know what I mean? Give, give the hand in pass. You know what I mean? Like, you know. So, so because, because I, I always say like you, you are delusional yeah. if you, you think, think in this in this era you are meeting a girl yeah. who's not been around. Mm. No, no, I mean, like where are you gonna find virgins? Where you gonna where you gonna let's be frank? Where are you going to find like you know get that one that one virgin? Because now I'm a two K's. I even worse than worse than the ninety that my like the the Gen Zs. You know what I mean? So you'd find out you'd find out by worse for me. I mean like isn't like worse. I just mean that it's because of I, I don't mean, mean that they are wasted wasted in, I just feel like they, they, they just exercising the, 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 you know, uh -huh. their, their freedom, freedom in, in, in a certain way. So, so it's, it's up to you if you, if you want, want to date that kind of person. person. Yeah. It's fine. Mm -hmm. I, I can't judge your interest. But I don't want to do that. I don't want to do Someone who's a prostitute or someone who's a porn star or someone who's a stripper. That's your own choice. If that makes you happy, because at the end of the day, for me, it's always about happiness. I don't want to be stuck with someone because, oh, she's supposed to be a virgin. You know, nothing in common. You know, there's nothing in common. She doesn't make me happy in whatever. Nah, and just because I'm she's a virgin, but ah, for him, nah. I mean, I value my peace and happiness. Yeah, you mean, uh, you just what I'm saying. You know, that's what I'm saying. Me, I, I, I value my peace. I value my, uh, what do you call it? Uh, my happiness. So, I don't know. You know what I mean? I think it's the issue. <laughs> Oh look, Camilla. I the thing is, uh, you know, my, my parents uh, move from uh, they move from Hawaii. Uh, Cause my dad used to my dad used to play with Thomas Mafu. So he moved he moved from Hawaii and moved to Hawaii. And then he joined because he used to be in a band with the Rockets and he joined. Uh, so from there, I remember we moved to Fako. So I moved, I think, with, I don't think I was even a year old. My sisters were older, but I think I was maybe a month old. So I just, you know, growing up, for me, it was growing up more in Harai. Um, I never had an experience growing up in Harai. I just grew up in Harai. Because my mom is short and my dad. So uh, we more, it was more of, I was raised. Uh, you know, from my grandmother, my grandmother, my grandfather, 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 my 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 Side of the family. Yeah. I think it was never an issue. Yeah. So, for me, it's like, you know, I was always, I don't know what to do, but I don't know what to do. 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 I don't know Oh yeah, so growing up with my dad, like, you, you always used to play reggae. You always used to play, um, uh, yeah, uh, for once, uh, one time I used to play, I thought Bob Mali was from Zimbabwe. Because he used to always play uh, Bob Mali in Banuelas. Oh yeah. Yeah, Mohammed in the house. And the Buffalo Soldier song would play. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you know. So when so my dad passed on, I needed a name that just, you know, remind me of my father. My father's name was Unity. That's why I'm always trying to Unity. I was like, I'm going to call myself Unity. And I was like, I'm going to play this book myself. And I started doing my research in Buffalo Soldier. I found that there were the first free slaves in America that uh, fought against the um, um, Bogdafu, um, what do you call it? The Ted, uh, uh, what's the name of the battalion? But I forgot about the eight, I think the eight or the tenth battalion. So, so they, they fought against the. Um, they were the, the first priests that, that, that were, were giving guns to fight against both well, the American enemies. enemies yeah. Yeah. And the way Indians used to call them could not really define them because they had, they had hair. Oh, so, so the hair that they had 
was, was who, who, uh, the, the, you remember the buffaloes in Africa? The buffaloes in America. The buffaloes in America have hair. So the red Indians could only refer them to oh, oh, those, those soldiers, the buffalo soldiers, and, 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 and so forth. So because, because I mean the, the storyline of that was just you know kind, kind of captured me. Yeah, I think I'll go this thing. Yeah, yeah, but but we we be soldiers, we be street soldiers, system soldiers. Soldiers. Yeah, yeah. Fighting against Babylon, isn't it? Because I wanted to do, you know, when you're a child, you just want to push your body, you just want to be like a father. You know what I mean? For me, so my dad was a, was an all rounder musician. He played every instrument. So, you know, there was one time when he left Thomas Mafumo, when he moved to, he got a job in Kariba. So he was playing in Kariba Hotels. It was a hotel called Kasaka Hotel. So he was playing in those hotels. So we, they, they would bring us there for, I mean, my mom would, Bring us from Fagos for holidays. Yes. So, uh, every, every time, time my mom would tell my dad, ah, you know your son can sing. Mm. My, dad like, ah, so my dad was a, a tough, tough one. You know? Oh, yeah. He's like, nah, he must be, okay, okay let, let me give him, give him a saxophone. If he can blow a note or something, yeah. 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 and then yeah. I'll take him serious. Yeah. Then my mom was like, no, when he knows, he sings. His instrument is his voice. And then, so one time I had an experience, because it was me and my younger brother. He's late now. So we'd, we'd go, go to, to the, f- to the forest, forest, and every time the baboons wants to move, going to the casa, to the hotel around 10, because they, they know that breakfast is going to be away. I mean, they're, 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 you know, leftovers left of the going away, so they would want to go get that. So me and my mother would go with the catapult, you know, and start hitting the baboons. That was the only thing we would do when we were no nothing just in the game area. Then, the one time the baboons, I think we eat the baby or the baboons, so the baboons chased us. From, from the boat, and they almost, almost caught us. Hey! So, so now they, they chased us hard when, <laughs> when we got, got home. I was like, yeah, I was like, yeah, I was like, yeah, I was like, yeah, I was like, So when, 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 when we were there, there now, hey, so, 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 so cool. Back at that, that time, time, I couldn't read it, right? Yeah. But, but I could claim. Mm. I could just claim something, right? So I started singing, like, one song. That was one of my first songs. I think I was like, eight years. Yes. Zoran Singa Kanga, Zoran Singa Kanga. So that is how the composition, you know, you don't know, you don't know you know, know what, what is what what what, what, what is causing your composition? Yeah, you know, you're actually inspired by yeah. the, the, the you know the activities, the you know, the surroundings. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. so, so you found that now we are kind of good now in the hood. You're, you're inspired by what's happening surrounding in the hood and, and stuff like that. You know, so as, as a base in the beginning, that was you know that was the <laughs> the vibe that I had from, from there uh, and stuff. And so it was always from my I think the inspiration came from my dad. But I was growing up, I had this. I had this anger, you know. So, so when, when when I get angry, so my dad would buy this when he bought me the Oliver, the Oliver you know, Remember that Oliver, Oliver, Oliver guitar, oh, the, the one that was made with twine, oh, yes, the one that from the head, yeah, Oliver from yeah, yeah. I get angry, I break it. Mm. He bought me a, a flute. I yeah. get angry, I break it. Mm. So I think the man tried. <laughs> to, Why were you to, <laughs> when I get angry, so I would be like, you know, I want to, I want to, you know. So when I get angry, I had always this thing say. Uh, Whatever you bought for me, I want to tear it so you can, you know, so you can, oh. you can get you, you can touch you. Uh. Then my dad was like, ah, but you just, you're breaking your own thing. I'm like, yeah, but you bought it. So you're feeling, you know what I mean? You bought it. You know what I mean? You bought it, so it's on you. I see. Yeah, so you know. Your first music group, the Intelligent Rackers Crooks. Oh, yes. That's right. That's deep. It was in 1996, you know. Yes. And it included David Zulu and Stuart Chamira. Yes, no. yes, yes, yes. How did yes, the three yes. of you come together? <laughs> yeah, well, that's deep. I didn't think you'd, <laughs> I didn't think you'd, you'd go that deep. Exactly. Well, they, they used to call us the IRC, mm-hmm. uh, the Ruckus Crooks. So the thing is, um, how it came about is that this is the era of your uh, Tupac, you know, the, oh, B- yes. the BIGs, oh, yes. you know, the Bone Thugs and Harmonies and mm-hmm. stuff. Uh, so it's like, a, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a thing of when you meet somebody who's on your, uh, not only on the creative 
same state of mind, mm -hmm. but somebody who's also on, the, on your same vibe. You know yeah. what I mean? Because growing up in the hood, you used to I'm a big pants guy, we hip hop. Yeah. You know, we always, you know, you know, the stylish. I'm going to be a rapper. That's always it's, it's, it's a natural thing, you know. Yes. So, but, yes. so because of that, you'd meet one who's also doing the same thing in mm. the hood. Mfakos was big, but Tango Zivan. Yes. You know, was big, but we, we pretty much knew each other. Mm -hmm. So with Diva Soul, now we were in the same street. Oh, yeah. Diva Soul, I think we used to also coach basketball. Mm -hmm. You know, we played basketball together. Yeah. And then he, he, was, he was mainly a singer. John Doe on the other side, now Stuart, you know, he was a, he was a conscious rapper. Mm -hmm. He was more of like a, yeah. you know, like a rapper. He was, I think he was more of your, um, uh, who's this man? Uh, because I mix on a Wu Tang Clan, would mix, you know, the, 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 he had more of that conscious, conscious rap, you know, yeah, uh, yeah. In, 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 um, in his style. Mm -hmm. Now, me, I was always in between. I was rapping, singing, yeah. and I was, I, I was doing a bit of reggae. Oh, okay. But also, I also had a hidden talent mm. that, I mean, um, that, that most of my guys didn't know. I could sing all types of local music. Okay. So, 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 Sungura, yeah. beat, whatever. Mm. Like, the, one of my, my songs that, that even got plays in Zim. You know, I know Ziaga. Hey, we in Zim. I get that Jiti song. Okay. Cause when I'm going to die, I know from Bane Mota. I see to your man, I show I'm going to die. I know from Bane Bilo. I see your man, I know from Bane Mota. I see Pika Vaskana. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So it was like that was actually my first first song that I know that um, as a solo artist played by radio so that yes. time here. Yeah. So, but because I mean, I know what a You know, I mean, versatility was always you know the thing. But then the for me the roots yeah. because from the introductory from my father reggae yes. whatever has always been that reggae dance vibe. You know, so I could wail, which is you know singing in reggae yes. called wailing. You know, mm -hmm. so uh, you know from there, to us, I'm like, no, okay, you know, let's uh, since now we are coming together now. Uh, what's your specialty? Ah, we are not rapper, we are there, so I want to R&B mm -hmm. music. Mm -hmm. I need to know, to, to know, okay, so, okay, this, since we are putting these forces together, so are, are we just going to be a rap group, mm -hmm. or what are we doing? Yeah. Ah, you tell me, okay, there's also this refugee camp, you know, mm -hmm. Wycliffe, and, uh, so, I don't know, why don't we just, sometimes, to take a maka rap, I have a dance, I have a singing, and whatever, so yeah. we're doing that. And it was like, okay, to rush on it, and to rush it, and to rush it, and to rush it, and to rush it, I used to New York, New York. So, Muhu, did you find my ones? My yo yo, my hippie, my yo yo, my hippie, my salad. You know, it was always um, the, 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 the thing for me. So, I was not a person. I was like, I'm going to go to my con rose. I was like, I'm going to go to my gay, my chichi. It was all sorts of names, you know? Dang. But we stick to, uh, nah, this is style, I know, this is what we do. Exactly. exactly. So, we did a couple of songs. I remember we had one of our songs together as a group. Mm -hmm. The, the, the reputation, mm -hmm. uh, and then it got played. Uh, not City. Mm. remember uh, when when power when it uh, was three FM paper. Yes. When the time you go to your waiting, i special every Wednesday. Should do a special. So I take a read. At my point, I take a One song a local, Muzibabu. The whole country will know about it. I take a read. I take a One nigga. You got to talk one in the next two months. Yeah. Because there was no local music playing mm. on radio. Yes. So that time, you know, the song I got is a one in oh, local. You got to ah, these boys are from here. What, what, exactly. what? They would know it in the next month. Exactly. exactly. Those boys are from here. So, you know, we would know it in the next month. Exactly. Those boys are from here. What, what, So, we became those boys from the faculty. I would, you know, I would, I would push out. And, and, and I understand, was, you know, during, during your, your time with the uh, yeah. intelligent records, yes. uh, you know, um, you used to uh, align with them, uh, pretty, pretty boy, yeah. uh, or ULD. ULDA, yeah. unity, unity lyric Dimic. Exactly. So, so the Dimic, the Dimic is Dimic here. Dimic here, all the yeah. Dimic is there. Yeah, yeah. unity lyric, that was... <laughs> <laughs> so was there any significance be behind, you know, the significance be behind um, these names, yeah. uh, particularly pretty boy? Mm -hmm. Pretty boy was more of a... Uh, because I I I was I my pretty boys I don't believe so I got out got out in so the so I got out got natural I got out I was a natural thing a natural thing so I was I was no I know pretty boy yeah ULD so I got out got out ULD unit unit was my father's name yeah and then the lyrics you know. Unit lyric, Dimic, and then the Dimic is Dimic. Yes. Yes. 
So, um, for us, you know what I mean? Like, you know, look, I mean, we were, the, the, the idea was like, you know what, we want to come in and we want to try. Then we did, because the inspiration is coming from, I'm going to MTV tapes. I was going to tell me, I'm going to tell you, the nice thing about Mfakos is like, you remember there was, the sub, the semi suburb, which is the suburb of Mfakos oh, yes. Marimba. Hey, hey, Marimba. So Marimba, my team, who my face is, and I saw, 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 and then we could watch your MTV, yes. we'd watch whatever. So we were clued up with the hip hop, with the, you know, the stuff was going on. So I was like, that's the inspiration. This is what we ended up with. It was always been the dream, but then. Um, uh, in England, you said that, 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 that now, was the approach. Now you are being played on MTV. But look, so for me now, it was like after, because I remember we shot our first video and Utah Ray Repetition. So we, had, we shot that video with an 8 mil, 8 mil, that's So good that is. So we said, we're over the next job, we're going to be AD. So AD, I shoot my video. So, but I don't know, AD, I look. When I saw the video, I shoot the thing. That's when I knew that I could direct music videos. Because I took, uh, I did the whole storyline, and then I had my brother come to me. So, because so, the song was the reputation yes, that you get if yes, you're from Fakos. Yeah. That's the reputation that you get, hey, mm -hmm. if you're from Fakos, hey, yes, this is what you get, mm. <laughs> coming from Fakos. <laughs> so now, if I imagine, the song is coming from Fakos. The idea was like, when you present the music, you should only present the music. You know, team, one time, one time, one time, one time, one time, one time, one time. <laughs> 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 That's the inspiration that I the songs we inspired from, you know, with our hood, but the meaning. Yeah. You know, then. So, uh, to the number studios, that's so, Then the only one guy that believed in us was mm -hmm. the damn fruit. Okay. Into the damn fruit. Okay, apology. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go to the back. Oh, yeah, yeah. So for free. free and da, da, da. So, we started recording. You put your hands busy, busy, busy. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's, that's, that's very, yeah. very interesting. You, you, you released, you know, um, three Afro hip hop albums with uh, with a group and uh, you were doing unique you know uh, things by mixing GT and hip hop like you said earlier yes. and using a bass you know uh, sequence that incorporated the mbira as well uh, in that you were doing quite uh, quite well as a group yeah. uh, why did you then uh, break up well, we didn't really break up so because you see the thing is like you know in every group mm -hmm. it's always that guy that's like guys this so you know who was that guy that, that woke up in the morning I'm like, man, ah, I'm too nice. Hmm. Ah, man, I'm too nice. So every day for me, it was always been like, like I'm too nice, so I'm like, I'm like, ah, this is not enough. Hmm. You know? So okay, let me just take a little bit back, right? In, in, the, in the hood, we used to do my, my, my modeling shows. Yeah. So I used to host, I was the first one to start hosting my modeling shows. I was actually the first one to host the modeling show as the Big Bang Beauty. Yes. Kind of like, oh, yes. So I was like, yeah, why go with skinny girls? Why don't you go with some people for the big entire group to see skinny girls on the stone, you know what I mean? Yeah. If they steal some pictures, videos, you know, some of the shows. Then we were, um, I had guys, and me and the guys were like, so why don't we use that? Because people want to listen to our kids. Yeah, you want to dance with the editor. Yeah. I was like, okay, no, yes, Twitter, hip-hop, you got to dance with the guy, but still, that he... How do we get the people to, you know, to like because our staff is in it? Yes. So I started hosting, we started hosting the, um, the, the, the morning show, mm -hmm. and then in between, we were the entertainment. Yes. So I was like, no, our team was away in our people. No, Zah, mm -hmm. that's not the way that I'm going to attend the whole. Yeah. Zah, we were like famous, uh, feeling up that we're going to attend the whole. So I was like, the whole, yeah. Then you have to tell my songs. Before the mode is over, my songs are in the So that's yeah. what we push yeah. most of our music at that time. Mm -hmm. So from there, I got out that I was in the, ah, we've done this. Let's do, let's do, let's go bigger. Mm -hmm. What do you want to do? Let's do. 
all the, the, the uh, Miss Big Bang Beauty all ghettos. Yes. Oh. So, uh, models from Fio. Uh, 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 exactly. Mm-hmm. And we started expanding. Mm-hmm. And we started like, ah, no, get jeans. I didn't know about shoes. I didn't know about shoes. So we started taking ourselves outside. We went to perform. I remember the time when Channel Low came here. Mm-hmm. That's when I, I changed I changed my mind. Yeah. Channel Low came. There used to be a club. I was close to the club. And it was a sports time. time. Sports yeah, time. Amazing. Mm-hmm. I think it was amazing. Yeah. It was amazing. So now that was, a, that was like a... That was after after my days ago. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> the, 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 the most push club that we had. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 okay. And so mm-hmm. so Maze was like a follow up on that. Yeah. So now Maze invited Channel Low. Mm. Like, yeah. Then I met all the Channel Low celebrities. Then I remember because me and my guys used to always have this thing. Mm-hmm. You know, when you go to any of these events, because they don't know us. Yeah. What do we do mm-hmm. that will make, what, that, that, that will bring attention to us? Yeah. Because, because some of these guys are, if, uh, uh, what's the rest of the people in the area, in the group? Mm-hmm. We like, look, so we really, really just, you know, in English. In yeah, yeah. That will give, bring us attention mm-hmm. to different ones like that. Yeah. You know, like, you know, we're not going to be here still. John Doe was like, yo, John Doe, it's a half. Exactly. You do play it in halfway. Overseer, half 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 half. Exactly. And I did a what a whole beat. Oh, yes. You understand? Yeah. And the diva so far, that's what I'm doing. I'm doing my judgment. I'm doing my judgment. Exactly. Now we knew that these cameras will come to us. Exactly. Because of what? The oh, they, they, yeah, the image. This is what mm. it's an image sale. Yeah. Right? yeah. We're going to get to the topic of film. Uh, like exactly. I'll tell you one or two things. Yeah. Image sales. So, we knew who the ad guy that is the ad trumbo. I don't know about that shit. Exactly. And we actually we did the the even came to us. Didn't need mm-hmm. right? I was wearing a wool jacket, like a wool jacket. Yes. The last one I don't like you. Afro guy is so. What she got? What did the interview was? You know, because I knew they would be looking for the coolest kids yeah. in the club. Because yeah. remember, when you edit, you know, when you shooting these things, you are always looking for mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. yeah, those, um, those you know attention to details. So the ah, what about the what? And the interview, the ah, decision. And I remember that clip. Ran on on channel or every time they say oh African tour yes that clip of us in the Afro oh the the oh yes yes so yes. I was like yeah, to the homies yo we made it we you see exactly so now what's, what's the next move hey. then I was like okay James let's go to the so mm-hmm. now I was working mm-hmm. I used to work at Pharmascope I was working okay. at the vets as a, as a vet sales mm-hmm. in Pharmascope mm-hmm. and then my stepdad was a was a manager there at at a, what do you call it? Uh, Pharmascope. Yeah. Yeah, we did go pay the school. I was there. But uh, then I was raising money. Then I had a team. Tell me I'm a job. Exactly. So what I did, I did, I did I, before I said uh, this, I was used to do trips. Mm-hmm. So no more trouble, I'm gonna leave. But the chat gets okay. I want to come, they don't drop on my game. Yes. Now we then I wanted to shoot. How do I shoot? Mm-hmm. Pain myself. Mm-hmm. Oh, let's see. Yeah. So what I want to do? I was like, yo. I hold back a bag. You know, see that. Remember my journey, darling. My prank guy. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh oh. And then we'll try the next scene. Exactly. Let's see the back. Oh oh. 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 Let's see the back. Oh, you don't go a car. Then we put it together. We put it together. Exactly. I got to get it. But then the content. So the videos. That's when I started. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Ah, it's why. It's why. It's why back. And you know, I I understand. Around um, two thousand and fourteen, two thousand and fifteen. Yeah. 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 Ye
2008, you know, you released uh, the hit song, hit, hit, hit dance song, so single uh, titled uh, Babu Ya Bums. Oh, yes. Yeah, you know, uh, which, uh, you know, it, it's gonna, um, it's gonna uh, widespread acclaim yes, and um, end you to channel all uh, Spirit of Africa Awards. Yes, yes. You know, how did it feel, you know, to receive um, such a recognition for, for your work? Look, I mean, uh, so you see, <laughs> The, let me just even take it to how tender, it's, it's the relationship that I had with Tendam Fruza was ongoing, you know. When I had that song, when I, so it's more like I'd, I'd met up with DJ Waxen. Mm -hmm. The guy was signed me that time. I uh, had the record label called Hardworks. So we were signed under Hardworks. We were signed under Hardworks, we were signed under Next Music. Next Music was like your Galo, Sony, and, and mm -hmm. so forth. So, uh, what happened that time, you know, we dropped that song and I wanted to shoot a video. I was like, yo, man, I'm going to shoot this video in Zim. It's okay, cool. Because, because see, uh, uh, Bubble Your Bums, there was two. There was the song called Bubble Your Bums, and mm -hmm. then there was another one called I Like It When You Shake Your Bum. Mm -hmm. That's uh, the title of it. Yeah. So, I had to go back to Zim. And then, I was like, to yo, I got this song, I want to come and shoot in the tender. like, yeah, hey, come too. Yeah. And we went there, and then we took all the models that were popping that time. And Tindai sponsored the video. Yo. You know, one thing about that man, man. Uh, that guy is hot. Yeah. I always yeah. tell people, like, for me, Tindai, the way Tindai believed in me, right, mm -hmm. is like, if he was still here now, yeah. I would have done collabs with Beyonce. Yes, man. yes. Because he had this thing of, if you tell him, ah, ah, Nigeria, look at the level, you know, Nigeria, mm -hmm. ah, Nigerians have taken to the next level. Yeah. Ah, look at this. Is Tinder will tell you, ah, okay, okay, nice, nice. Mm -hmm. ah, so what are they doing? I said, ah, no, no, this could Oh, okay, okay. Exactly. The next day, he will call you. Let's do this. Like, ah, how can we do? How can we get Jay Z? Mm -hmm. That was him. He was always yeah. like that. Yeah. He was not, you know, he was never a guy that's like, Wamuza. I once told the one guy that also reminded me of Tinder Fruits is, is uh, Java. Mm -hmm. I told Prophet Java, and, uh, you, you, you remind me of how. Uh, Tendai. Tendai was. Mm -hmm. Because Tendai Mfruza was angas na limiti, angas na vume. You know, I was like, I don't know. If, because this is how, people don't even know how he got to the level of bringing in Aircon and Sean Paul. Oh, yeah. yeah. Because it was me and DJ Waxi convinced. We started speaking about it. I was like, oh, oh, about that event? Yes. Wow. I was like, yo, look. There's bad, that time it was bad publicity in Zimbabwe. They, yeah. If you ask DSTV, they not want to do the time even things to, to do Zim because yeah. of that name, bad publicity. Yes. Like, sanctions and whatever. Exactly. Like, it was just like everything that comes... So it was hard. Even for me, like, when I'd go and win an award and be like, yo, for Zimbabwe, I used, I used to feel like, oh, do you know what I mean? Yeah. They wouldn't want to be like, yeah, but I don't care, though. It's because, mm. you know, that's who I am, you know? And, Takashi Kabaguti, Tendana Tongu, let's push him, we pushed him. So when, when the talks, going back to the, the bomb, the, the bubble bombs, you know, and then we shot, and I was like, we shot the video, and then we came, uh, came back in Channel and I put a channel, Tendana was sponsored, being like, nah. Mm -hmm. You know, anything, anytime. Let's do this. Put it on video, da da da, bah. Next thing, win awards. Mm. Like, huh? Win awards? That's what we are from Channel O. So, because, you see, this is why I wanted to go back. You see, the thing, the thing with me, well, I, I won't like you. I'm sorry, I'm doing this, 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 I told my guys, I'm man, I did no push-up jokes. Yes. I was doing the trips and dropping my demo. Yeah. Doing the trips, dropping my demo, my videos. Knocking for my doors and 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 you know, I was always a guy, and then mm -hmm. I, you know, so I met up with Jassy, and then when Jassy and then we're doing uh, the reggae nights at uh, every Thursday in in, in Yeovil, mm -hmm. the club called Tando. Oh yes. Then I, you know, I come there and I grab them. I go for the back. No, no, hunger. What do I have? Papo. I used to have books. Like, to, to today, right? I have, I have books and books like this. Mm. I just write books. Yeah. Who know that? Because so what I do like now, right? Before the bang, there's a before the bang. I think I have like. I have like 3,000 voice notes. Oh. See. See. Jeez. So what I do is every day, right? Yeah. That's I, too much. I come up. <laughs> oh. Every day. So what I do every day, I sing something. If I, uh, 
Dodo in the nigga who wrote Kogan Data. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I dream of music. Mm -hmm. I always tell people people say, How do you dream of music? You know, how you dream of how I dream of music? Mm -hmm. I dream of music. Look at go rota Michael Jackson Ajimba. Serious? But no one wrote Bob Mala Chimba. I don't want to write any artist that you win. But then I wake up, then I'll be like, yo, but the song you win boy, I exist. Exactly. So, it's a, it's a, it's so when I wake up song. in the morning, and I was like, yo, but this song that Michael Jackson was singing does not exist. Yeah. Then I quickly try and what? To memorize it. Mm, and then I, I record the idea, concept. Yeah. So sometimes I'm just doing something else. I just create music. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I say, but when I'm doing creativity, after six, I say, don't create the music. After six? I'm not going to do it. After six, I'm not going to do it. Bang! You may hit ah. after sex. You know, I'm, I'm telling you, I don't know. I don't know what is it about. This is crazy, I, 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 I don't even really know what is. I, I don't, this is crazy. I don't, I'm not saying boys should go out and try it. Exactly. But I'm just saying. <laughs> and then after sex, no one will create a song. Are you? You have a. The don't go inspire. Yes. I'm just saying. Don't go inspire. I'm just saying it. Ah, that must be a good one. Trust me. Trust me. Because after you know, you see the boys like ah, you know, no inspiration, no motivation whatsoever. Yeah. But yeah, you know. <laughs> so. I went and uh, then you know that's how that's how for me that's how we, find, we got to channel law mm -hmm. and then started playing meeting up DJ Waxy, yes. da, 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 da. you know we do, do you still talk to these guys yeah 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 we do uh, diva so uh, I keep telling us we do that by WhatsApp and again diva but the thing with diva right uh -huh. diva so we didn't split so, so then I just went and I managed to push at you oh yeah so, oh I see and I was supposed to second change up pretty good more exactly diva so is not really he doesn't really like. Like the travel, like you know, when you go there, ah, diva, diva, we say, buff, keep doing it, ah, man, just keep doing it. It was never like, you know, I'm like, ah, okay, let's let's, let's go international. Ah, he's, he's always been a contender. He's good. Yes. He's like, nah, I mean, I'm in, I'm, 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 I'm home. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, I want to do things for the community. He pushes. He does. Um, uh, he coaches yeah. my my father and my youth. Mm -hmm. He's always been that guy, you know. You, you know, don't, don't every, a different path. Yeah. yeah, every every journey uh, mm -hmm. got uh, you know some highs and the lows. Definitely. Um, Definitely. Along your journey, you know, is there a point or was there a point where you ah, you know what, let me just quit music in the Chicha Yaitke Babo or in the Rasuja I think it was around 2014. Mm -hmm. I think 2014, 2013, right? <clears throat> so I, I announced that I'm quitting music. Yeah. I think it was the year of the last Channel Law Awards as well. Mm. Then I announced that, ah, you know what, and I'm quitting music. Mm -hmm. ah, but I'm going to make this announcement. That was like now we've been nominated again. Oh. By Channel Law for the, it was a reggae dance mm -hmm. artist, but we a uh, reggae dance category mm -hmm. and in other, um, you know, more southern, whatever. Oh, yeah. Other genres, best male and whatever. Mm -hmm. I just dropped a song in the Bassa Wine. Mm -hmm. So Bassa Wine is one of the videos, and I got to drop a song in my shot when I was like, Buffalo, I'm going to be a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little bit of a little so then he's, he's exactly. I've always been uh, that kind of art young guy has always been, you know, I've I've, I've broken certain barriers. Yeah, I've, to the extreme. It's it's like I'm about to make a garo my video. Exactly. Exactly. Based on that, I'm about to make a garo. Based on that, I'm about to go 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 artistic in terms of. Exactly. You know what I mean? So for that, thousands are no money to them. So it was me and my guys are uh, was managing me. If I would team around and I come, I do yeah. But I've just, I've just announced that I quit. Because me for now, that time, and then I don't quit. I don't know what's going on. Okay, that's you, man. Exactly. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. Then, but now we, we've been nominated. Mm -hmm. Same time, hey. I, I get chosen to be, be one of the ambassadors for the one campaign, um, the O2. Oh. Uh, Bono. Yes. Bono O2. That's powerful. At, at that same time, mm -hmm. Which led uh, to me being the first Zimbabwe into performing uh, the White House. Hey, and, uh, White House. You know, yeah, the America. White House, America. Okay, that's big. So it was me. They chose me. Um, uh, uh, Dibanj, mm -hmm. Fali Pupa, um, uh, Diamond Platinum. Wow. Uh, a couple of artists, man. Ah, but that's uh, big. Yeah, that's so, big. So we at that's that same big. year of me uh, 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 retiring, mm -hmm. just quitting. They didn't even retire. Hey, yeah. So. And I, I gave a whole, you know, wrote a whole, I'm an this is frustrating, I've been exactly. doing this for a year, but ah. Exactly, I, I don't want so, to do it So, anymore. depression is real, mm. but when mm. so you, you were depressed Yeah, then. but yeah, depression, young when I see it, was also, and also, was mm. and stuff like that. Yeah. Because growing up, yes, I was not suicidal as such, but I was one of those 
Mom is on the two government. Ah, let's see. I don't got yes. no, 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 yes. three days and she can't find me. Mm -hmm. You know, I've always been that child, but not that. Ah, mm -hmm. But I've, I always had that thing of, ah, because you really get But it's, it's for me, if, 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 I, I, I still have to do that, that anger management. Because yes. this type of sometimes you inform, but you know, but Buddha. So, you <laughs> get to get to so. Yeah, can I Bavu Rimbo, and I won't like you. I'm going to go to Mammy's. I'm sorry to say this, but. I was lucky because we did martial arts as, as, as the youth. Yeah. We were and karate and stuff like that. I like that. I don't know if 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 and in um, what's the name? Say colors. Now, all the colors. Oh yeah, yeah. The reason why I went to uh, Panay is it was City Gumba mm -hmm. event. Oh yes. Because I was City Gumba, they took our colors. And we don't care. And I don't mummy such. I don't believe by that. Serious. And I don't care. Well, I'm not really. I tell you, I'm going to do one. I'm going to do that. The whole shutter wall. But because of phone, I think I think I was going to squash, squash, squash. I think I was going to. I think Zim said it. Exactly. We did a phone call. Louis actually. Exactly. Phone call. That. That's why they. Ah, pan attention, pan attention. Because the thing we miss, right? I have that attitude. Because remember, I'm coming from that era of the hip hop, like beef. The big is small. <laughs> you know, beef is when guaranteed never in an ICU. Exactly, exactly. What's beef? Mm. You know, so I think we're going to make a good answer. We're going to make a good answer. Because remember, growing up, growing up in, a, in a hood, we took a lot of, hey, hey, go, hey, go, chan, mm. hey, but, hey, this, this is, hey, mu, mu, hippie, hey, mu, yo, yo. You know, so you had to always fight. Yes. Yeah. Because we're going to put this on the ones that every day, we're going to put this on the start of the hour. So sometimes that, that's why. <laughs> And in total time in the management, I got to say that to go. I, 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 my, my mom was always like, uh -huh. I thank God that you that you pursued mm. just in music. Because if it wasn't for music, yeah. I said that is my gun as I won't lie to you. Because but, but are, are you now good with the um, with cell colors? Cell colors? Oh no, no, we're we good. We're good now. We spoke because because you're talking of fighting and squabbles, you know, you had a squabble with them. Um, uh, US rapper Lil Wayne, you know, uh, or rather made some uh, yeah. calculative moves. You know, it's not uh, something with uh, Lil Wayne, uh, Lil Wayne's management back then. And yeah. I understand this squabble was about a South African rapper called Young Nacho. Yeah, you know, a Young Nacho, exactly. Um, who had a resemblance to you yeah, know, Lil, Wayne. Lil Wayne, exactly. Yeah, Can you yeah. explain to us, you know, what really happened? So, so happen? what I'm, what I'm, in, in the international abuse, I'm a mm. <laughs> So, what, what happened is like, um, I spoke to the promoter of the event. Yeah. Because I was pushing these boys, you know, and um, the name, the, the, the crew name was Slipknot. Mm -hmm. So one, one of the kids' dad was like, you know, really wealthy at that time, and uh, it was Angolan. Mm -hmm. So Young Nucho was the kid. So Young Nucho had this whole Young Money mm -hmm. thing going on, because yeah. these kids were like, they, you know, they lived, breathed Young Money. Exactly. That was, it was, that was the, the, you know, the, the life, the mm -hmm. lifestyle. So they approached me, it's like, ah, oh, Buff, yo, man, we've been watching your, your thing. Um, you know, we we wanna you know be part of your movement and, mm -hmm. that. and let me okay okay let me go back to sorry let me just quickly go back to the uh, yes. uh, to the year I quit it. This is when I made this boy. Oh yeah. So the year I quit, so many things came. The year I quit, uh, I met also uh, Queen V mm -hmm. came. It's like yo, oh, can yes. you also manage me? Can mm -hmm. you also the the boys also came in manage? But you know where where I was? People don't even know that mm -hmm. yeah when I quit, I went back home. Hey. Nice. I was in Zim. Mm -hmm. I stayed in Zim for like months and nobody knew. Yeah. I was in my mom's home, staying with my mom's home, my mom's home, but then. Indoors? Thought, yeah, indoors. But now my mom, it's uh, just that Galatine is in Zimbabwe too, come forward. So, name by Gogas. Yeah. Then, yeah, 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 you know, the Marine and Zim Sikavakazi. behind us. Exactly. <laughs> but anyway, so from there we moved. We, we, my mom later on got a stand with Budiriro. Mm -hmm. And then she built in Budiriro. So when I moved with her, and we were in Budiriro. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to go there. All these um, um, contacts were on my Facebook. Mm -hmm. So I never used to check my Facebook. Yeah. So Pandai read and then I walked. She doesn't even check it. It's my Facebook. Oh, yeah. So. I was like, one day, let me just go check my inbox. That's when I started seeing all this. Mm. Hey, Bafa, mm. Queen V, Chichin, Yeah, we are. Yeah, yeah. 
So I can't, I'm like, yo, should I tell this dude I'm not, I'm not in, in SA anymore? Yes. I was like, you know, mama, I think I need to go back to SA. Exactly. Then I low key, bah, bah. Yeah. Been a buzz food. I guess it's a chicken buzz. Exactly. I guess I'm a gray. I'm a gray. I'm a gray. I'm a gray. I'm a ginger, you know. But I pinned the, 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 the buzz food. I pinned the, yeah. She gave me a face one. Yeah, that's what, that's what. Talking about the boys. Ah, hey, bab, you, you, you. I found a neutral, team without any big. Hmm. If I'm going to be mad, I'm going to be big. You know, this is what we're doing. Man, we're pushing young you know, we're pushing young money thing. Exactly. Dog, it's really here, my nigga. You see, see the money. So that, that's, that's that boy. Because he's an Angolan, but he was also, you know, trying to be, you know, yeah, Atlanta. Exactly, thing. exactly. Big buff, see the money, big buff. You know, <laughs> the money is here, big buff. Exactly. Why, exactly. Big buff, they just do the music. You, 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 yeah. That time, the father did little way. Exactly, there. exactly. My chat touch your ass. Little way. Little way. Ah, but I can start starting going little way. Yes, yes. Ah, you know what I found out? You're just going to find out you want to drink. You're going to find out you want to light skin. You're going to find out you want to touch. Yeah, boys, you're going to make us. But you don't go to Zoga. Exactly. Then they say, but I said, man, I don't know something. I don't know about the apartment. So you're going to go to the Exactly. You're going to go to the I'm sorry about the queen. You're going to go I'm So those guys like uh, Young Nucha and uh, and Queen V, they made you come back. They made me come back. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. You know I mean? So at that time I was like, you know what, I'm coming back. Mm -hmm. And also, this now we are nominated on my words. Yeah. Ah, now we, you, you, you one, one campaign, now we are. Ah, exactly. I was from one campaign. Ah. Yeah. I'm like, yo, left, right, and center, you know. So, these are things where some of these projects that we're entering, then you get into, you know, oh, yeah. Panama royalties. Yeah. 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 Panama royalties. Yeah. So, did, did you actually have a, had a, like, direct, you know, e, you know, squabbles with the, the management? So, yes. So, now this is what happened, right? So, Panama Royalties and I got a, got a, got a, uh, um, uh, Squad and every young man, yeah. Then I'm planning to Scooby, DJ, DJ. So everybody came. So everybody was waiting for Lou Wayne to come in the in, in the club that night. Mm -hmm. in so South Africa. In, yeah, Joe Buggy was. Uh, that's the time when Lou Wayne was here. Oh yeah. But before that, what had happened was like I asked the manager, uh, the, the, the the promoter of the event. I was like, Yo, dog, look, um, my homie, my boys are saying they want to give you the, the offer in 150k exactly. for them to perform to open up for Lou Wayne. Mm -hmm. Because I found out that Tenga, you see, the thing is, they didn't want to put my boys on. Oh, yeah. So, you know, I had different strategies. I was like, you know what, okay, me using the same strategies. They don't want to put my boys on. And they said, ah, but if it's you now, we're going to have these boys. Yeah, exactly. We're really feeling these boys. I was like, yeah. okay, cool. Fine. Then I would buy any show that I see that there's a hip hop lineup or yeah. big lineup. Yeah. I would go to the from there, like, just, just get 3K, man. Exactly. Put my, my, put my boys on. Yeah. Like, ah, okay. Ah, sure, boy. Instead of you getting the money, you were. Give because the, we're promoting that. Yes, I see. I was doing the PR for that. Mm. So now, when I when I did that, there was an event. I remember because that's also the beef. Also, how the beef started with yes. AKA, with AKA. Yeah. So we went there. Then um, AKA was performing before them. So I was I always tell dudes, no, let my boys perform before. <laughs> Then when my boys go on, I'm like, yo, James, just know that most of these guys don't like you. And they don't know you. Need, oh you know, yeah, yeah. Check out ten thousand rands hey. and before you perform, spray it in the crowd. Exactly. I got that from Jay Z. Jay-Z was like, yo, before me and them, they didn't really like our music. We changed money into dollar dollars. Oh, yeah. Dollar bills. Yeah. And we get to a stage. We spray. The people jumping in. We start reading the show. Dollars. Yeah. <laughs> I use it sometimes. If you notice, I use, sometimes I, I, throw, I throw the money in the crowd. I did it at the, uh, I don't know if it was Gombe, uh -huh. at Winkies. But I did it. It's the thing that I want so to do. It's, it's a strategy. It's a strategy. Mm. And I'm like, you know, exactly. I'm going to put it in my own I don't know. 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 I don't I this young money, uh, Lou and uh, young money wanna be niggas. I don't have money to throw you, but I got lyrics to throw you. Oh, Where's you guys? Yeah, yeah. So the boys are like, I'm a big bad this boy is saying that we, 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 we fuck this nigga up now. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? So, cause me and AKA was cool cause of, uh, we done songs, uh, 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 on his first album, The Outer Ego. Uh -huh. We done the song, the, uh, what's the song? You collaborated with him? Yeah, on a song called Rain. Oh yeah. That was his first album. Mm -hmm. 
So, so now when the world tweeted things started, Eke's like, yeah, but Buff, yo, you and me are cool, though. I'm like, yo, but Eke, you, you and me are cool, man. Why would you attack the boys that you know that with me? You're attacking me, you're attacking me, man. Of course, yeah. And, and then, it, you know, the whole thing started, you know, the boys are like, yo, mm -hmm. let's set this, 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 this nigga, I meet this nigga up now. We, yes. we, we, we bring the pit bulls mm -hmm. and we bring the, uh, you know, it was just some gangster shit at the time. But then, um, then now, when we wanted to go to the, then they didn't want, want the boys to, so when I spoke to the promoter, the promoter didn't want the boys to come on the, mm -hmm. the show. To open up for them. Yeah. I said, yeah, but they're over 150 k man. Like, nah, I spoke to the other guys. They don't want to. I was like, okay, cool. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I sat yeah. down. I started thinking. Because the thing with me is like, I always genize. I always, you know, my mind is always like, you know what I mean? And most of the things yeah. pre is premeditated. I do is a lot of premeditated stuff. Yeah. And I was like, okay, gents, let me call my, and I call 10 of, 10 of our bouncers that we used to move with at the time. Oh, yeah. I was like, yo, gents, come through. The boys used to live like young money, the biggest mm. house, big pool, you know, girls always chilling. Yeah. It was that vibe. Mm -hmm. So the bouncers come. And I took a video. I took a pic first. Then I said, okay, let's go to Sentin. Yeah. Let's go sit in a restaurant in Sentin and let the bouncers come. So I didn't say it's Little Wayne or Little Wayne here. I just said, let's move how we move. Yeah. yeah. Everybody knew Little Wayne was in the country. Mm. So the exactly. fact that they just saw bouncers exactly. and a young man, a Little Wayne looking exactly. like dude. Exactly. If you, go, if you go on YouTube, just go and check Young Nucho. Mm -hmm. Uh, incenting, mistaken for Lou Wayne. <laughs> Everybody started coming in like this. Ba hey, they saw the bouncers. Yeah. Like, ah, that's that's the real, real little one. Yes, yeah. 10 bouncers. Hey. So we sit at the restaurant, bye bye. We start eating. Then one girl was like, hey guys, I just want to take a, I just want to take pictures. I was like, no, no, that's not Lou Wayne. I said, no, I just want to take, that's what you guys always say. They say, we just want to take pictures. Like this. They had to bring security person hey. to them. And I know, James, you guys have to leave. Yeah. Then we had to leave. Yeah. Type, type. yeah. Type, type, type. So when that worked, and I was like, they're like, big buff, you're a big buff, you're a genius. Big, <laughs> big buff, how did you come up with this one? This one, ah, big buff, you. I was like, you know what? Okay, exactly. now, James, let's go more to more. Exactly. Doing the same thing. Yeah, because we only wanted, it was like, this kid is a Lou Wayne. Yeah. I uh, yeah. wanna be look exactly. alike, look after mm -hmm. Lou Wayne. He's a fan of Lou yes. Wayne. He's, he wanted to meet Lou Wayne. Exactly. He wanted, to open up a Lou so Wayne. So you did and everything. Wayne, yeah. And you guys, you want, you want the kid to jump on. So now we're doing other things. Exactly. You know, to, you know what I mean? Because I'm, 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 I'm promoting the kid. Exactly. So whichever way, you know, I have to promote the kid, I'm uh -huh. going to promote the kid. Yes. So, ah, Pepe, that's what I'm going to do. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to the team. 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 Ah, this is what I'm going to do. I'm telling you, this kid made it to... They started, no, before, uh, uh, before that, mm -hmm. that's the night now of the club. The promoters and the guys, I think they started telling them, oh, I don't know, we ever was moving with Louis. Yeah. Started telling them that this guy's an imposter, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. who's, you know, it's, it's bad for business. Yeah. He's, he's telling people it's Louis Wayne and it's going to mess up. Yeah. yeah. So Louis Wayne didn't, we, I think the, the crew didn't really take light mm -hmm. because of, they felt like we were now leeching off them. Oh, you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. So, which is all, you know what I mean? Not exactly what exactly. we're doing. We just, we're just riding off the mm -hmm. web now. Mm -hmm. We got there. To, now we're going to the club. Uh, Montana, they call it Montana now. It was Moloko. Oh, yeah. We pull up, I know the club owners. All right, we come in. Ah, Bob, what is it? So they also don't know. Is Bob moving with Lil Wayne or what's going on? So as we enter, they're they taking us to the VIP with Lil Wayne. Why? <laughs> oh, that is where the issue started. Finally. <laughs> the issue was they want to take us to the VIP of Lil Wayne. Aye. And not knowing that, that's not, this is not young money. <laughs> so Scooby now stops the music. Uh -huh. So God and them started stopping and uh, uh, no, no, these niggas can't come here. You know, I mean, it's not, you know. Because what? The way there's already been like, yo, there's these niggas that are moving like they're doing. Hey. So we with 10 bouncers. Oh. You know what I mean? So they can yeah, bounce us or fight. Of they course. just say, yeah, hold up. Yeah. You know what I mean? They want bouncers like, hold up. You know? yeah. Our guys are just like. So Scooby's like, yo, yo, hold up, man. Hold up. Yo, hold up. <laughs> Stop the music. Yo, yo, don't be alarmed, man. This, this, this ain't Lou Wayne, man. This, this ain't wanna be, yeah. wanna be Lou Wayne, African nigga trying to roll up, you know, moving out like Lou Wayne. Hey. So people didn't really also like the fact that it's like some African nigga. Yeah, you know, trying to believe right. yeah. Going, you know? yeah. Yeah. And so instead of people booing us, people just like stupid. Like, you know, cause they probably thought people were gonna boo. Like, hey, yeah. you know? So people didn't really boo. Oh yeah. So people just, you know, didn't really like the, the tone and, you know, how it was. Yo, them niggas ain't that young man. Them niggas ain't, ain't got money, man. This ain't real money. We got real money. <laughs> well, what? Ah, so it was like, Instead of people were just like, nah. So the club owner just comes to me and like, yo, buff. Mm -hmm. You know, you just leave. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, yo, but we just want to sit on the, we're going to sit on the other side. Exactly, exactly. And then the niggas like, nah, nah, them niggas got to leave, them niggas got to get the fuck out of here, dog. They got ah. to leave, man. I was like, ah, dog. Damn. 
So, and which is weird to leave. Yeah. But before we leave, it was almost like it was now a positive answer because my nigga was like, nah, fuck little Wayne, damn me. I used to look up to this nigga. And this nigga wants to wants to now do do like this. Then fuck that nigga, damn my nigga. Oh. I, don't, I don't even care. This is Africa, my nigga. Like, oh, now you been African, my nigga. <laughs> now you been you new way, man. You American. Now you been African, my dog. Yeah. Like, this is Africa, my nigga. My this nigga TIA, my nigga. This yeah. is Africa. Yeah. I was like, ah, okay, my dog. Man, let's just okay, let's roll out, dog. You know. So now it was a bit of you know pushing, pushing. Whatever. They like we move. Yeah. So as we move, That's that same time, the kid made it on TMZ. Hey. Bah, he's on TMZ. They're talking about him. Yo, this Lou Wayne wanna uh, look like guy. Uh, exactly. Uh, Lou Wayne winning this, uh, fighting with this guy. So now the boy is trending in America. Mm. It's trending everywhere. Oh. You know what I mean? So it was good PR then. Thank you very much. Yeah, so it was good PR. So immediately I was like, yo, let's go home. Because remember with everything, the, the studios exactly. and everything. Like, yo, yeah. Let's go to the studio, record a song. Now just drop a song called I'm Not Wayne. Yeah. I'm not, not Wayne. Yes, yeah, so no double song. Wow. I'm not Wayne. Yeah. I'm not Wayne. <laughs> the boy drop a song. Wayne, da, da, da. It's Queen, Queen V me in the video, and then we drop the video. Hey, the video is so out trending. Everything's yeah, trending. Yeah. Yeah. So man, nigga, milk it, milk it. Yeah. Yeah. So boy started dropping songs. Now we started dropping songs. Now boy started, you know, started trending. But, you know, I mean, later on, man, the keys started, drugs got to the keys. Mm. So many things started happening. Oh. And da, 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 da. Um, the father was like, I kid needs to come back. And exactly, so exactly. The, the band ended up just, just made, you know, so where is he now? The time. He's, 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 funny enough, he's a, he's a pastor now. Oh, yeah. really? Oh, yeah, he's a pastor. He's now. not preaching. He's in Angola, yeah. Ah, he's big in Angola as a pastor. He's running the, the dad's business. Yes, yeah. yes. Oh, I see. So he had to grow up. <laughs> you know what, moving on now, my brother. Uh, there's yeah. a notion in Zoom, you know, uh, that notion that um, uh, Winky D is yeah. the God, you know, greatest of all time. Yeah. And, um, What's your take on that? I know you've got this good relationship with Winky. Well, look, uh, you see, it's, he, he is, you know, when you're greatest, greatest of all time, mm -hmm. it's, it's because of, um, there's, there's a period of time though, like, you know, we, in America, they would, they would always measure it with maybe if you, if you run a, a decade mm -hmm. of, con of, con of constantly dropping uh, uh, current music. Yeah. But current music, I mean, like music is going to be like trained at that time, mainstream and, yes. you know, chatting music mm -hmm. and, so, and so forth. You know, you kind of, you know what I mean? You've reached your, 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 your gut level. Yeah. Which is the greatest of all, all time. time. Yeah. You know I mean? yeah. Mm. So I think he qualifies to be the greatest, the, 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 the greatest of all time. He qualifies to be a goat in Zim. Mm -hmm. But now they, we use goat for the, the word is misused now. Yes. Everyone is, if you drop two hit songs, now you're a goat. I'm a, a goat. goat yeah, uh, yeah. Two, three albums, you're a goat. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, it's, um, it's albums. It's a, it's a period of time yeah. that makes you the greatest of all, all time. time. All yeah. time. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. Part, empathy, you know? Mm -hmm. All time. Yeah. So uh, now I'm going to go to the goat. Even, even though I'm going to go to the goat. Yeah. So I'm a goat in a different way. Different, uh, no, no, no. In a different mm -hmm. a market. Mm -hmm. And a different, um, what I did. In, mm -hmm. in, you know, you see, Winky, you can't take away what did Winky did in Zim. He's a god. He's a god, yeah. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. All of them, too, because he was here, he'd also mm -hmm. be a god. You, know, yeah. you know, so in the genre mm -hmm. of the dance or in the reggae, yeah. you know, Winky is a great, mm -hmm. great all time. Yeah. And also to also have. He, he just he, released the, he was the he, first new one. songs recently. Yeah, yeah. Which ones are you, are you, are you vibing to? Uh, I told him, we were talking recently, mm -hmm. um, you know, about expanding the marketing as well. Yeah. So um, I was listening to the. Yeah, yeah it's, a, it's a nice song. I love mm -hmm. the melodies. Yeah. Um, and then the English one as well. I told him that let's push that one outside. Mm -hmm. um, the one fish and fryer. Yeah. Is also a, 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 a good, good one. Song, mm -hmm. A good song. And because remember, it's, it's like um, Winky will, will be misunderstood there at that time with what he's trying to do. Um, see what I was saying? Like, well, this is what I mentioned that the crossing over. Mm -hmm. When you when you doing sound music and then and then. You were a dancer artist, mm -hmm. but then you managed to break, because he was the first one to break through yeah. the other genres, mm. break through other markets. Markets, yes. You know what I mean? Yes. Back in the days, doing dance, I don't know. We didn't need you, you were a show, maybe. Thank yeah. you very much. So now, yeah. he was the first one to like, to start breaking through, mm. you know, my, my barriers are uh, in, in the sound, you know? Mm. So, that makes him the greatest of all time, because oh, you're pioneering yeah. certain yeah. things. Yeah. There's so many things, so many aspects. That makes you um, the greatest of all time in in in, in, in a, you know mm -hmm. in that uh, um, line. Yeah. So he he managed to do that, and I feel like he he deserves. Uh, so you, you've done you know a number of our collaborations, um, you know, with the many Zimbabwean artists, like of uh, likes of um, 
Freeman, XQ, yeah. Enzo, Aisha, Kina. Yeah. Kina yeah. No, who did you enjoy working with the most? Um, I'll say I'll say all of them, man. Uh, I'll say all of because everything is uh, all of all of the, all the features were different experiences. Like with uh, with with Enzo, it was a uh, a time when Chill Sport was just like just Chill Sport doing the rhythms mm. and tapping and dropping the rhythms. You know, and Fana Enzo had their own movement. You know, yes. that, that that movement. That because I remember when I got there, all the kids came up, man. The Fana Vesa and a and a pop team. Yes. Uh, and a Winds. Uh, you know, uh, um, uh, Puma was there. Exactly. All the guys, all the boys were yeah. there. You know what I mean? Bazooka. And, and. So, what me is, I've always come from where I have, I get clans, I get mm. artists, I get groups, I get whatever. So I'm always, you know, fond of that type of vibe. You know. Yeah. So when we get there, I know, you know. Enzo, the vibe, 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 uh, levels, but I know about one of the many readings. I want to tell my readings, tell my readings, tell my readings. Levels, I'm worried they are that reading. Then I said to Enzo, yo, look, I can do a kitchen room. Yeah. You know, let's just do a vibe kitchen room. You know, because my thing has always been, right? Remember, I come with the mentality of you are coming from an international market. Yeah. So, if you're gonna put your leg in, try to also bring the boys. Kunzo, kun market ya uru zikano. Because when I say international market, they would you you need like a post that jump on my stories, bang bang. My views on ganu bangana na na bonang matema ya na na di bangi. The video views my stuff. Um, Netflix, DSTV. Exactly. So that is that is when we say you know you you have that database. Yeah. You, they see yeah. what they see what you what do, you like do what, you do what, you what you share and whatever whatever and so forth, right? Yeah. If you go to by, 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 by Instagram, I think if Sean Paul follows me, I mm. mean, on, uh, uh, Biniman follows me on Instagram, wow. Sean Paul follows me on Twitter, I think. Wow. You know, all those things. So, so I always say, like, do uh, platform you know, you know, what is that? Exactly. I think I had the biggest beef in mm. I've been a Benna boy. Yeah. You know, and all those type of things, you know. So, me and Enzo was like, you know, if we do this, Katishi's or Tony Chino Fambo, some even played in Ghana, mm. Nigeria. So the, it did, it did uh, its own its own way. So I would say Enzo was was a good experience, a dope experience. And who, who, who do you wish you wish to to work with? To wish to work with? Yeah. Uh, it is him. Oh, and um, um, me and uh, Japres has also been talking mm -hmm. to do to work on some stuff. Yeah. On music, mm -hmm. so on a time, uh, Killer T, uh, Killer T as well. Yeah, I always like, I always like Killer T's vibe. Mm -hmm. And the one guy that also uh, almost we almost worked, mm -hmm. and it's like a and the Soldier Love. Okay. So one time we did with a gig here mm -hmm. to run big. Oh, Soldier Love worked a lot with Queen V. Yeah. So yeah. Queen V was because mm -hmm. you know she's she's like. The nicest soul, man. Yeah, yeah. You know, because the time I time I released, and then people would hate. I was like, why do you hate me? Mm, exactly. She's the nicest person that you yeah. ever met. You know. Mm -hmm. I remember so playing. Uh, like, I remember playing his song on radio, Mari yeah. Mari. Mari Mari. Thank exactly. you very much. Yeah. <laughs> and she was like, no, uh, but please, wait there something on on Soldier Love. Exactly. Ah, but just like even with Soldier Love, would because Soldier Love would aita would you take a shanda so like even when I was shooting the videos on directing the videos, like, do you shoot a Soldier Love? I'm going to disappear. I'm going to borrow it. Borrow it. So I'm going to disappear. <laughs> what is that? Yeah, baby, it's a bad set. Hey, let's say that. So, just be patient. You know, I don't want to say that. We're also talking about time, time. Exactly, exactly. You know, so he was always been. He's always been. That was his, his character, and that was how you know he was. So, the time when we were supposed to work, that happened again. Oh, that was 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 that Hey, you got a pay scene, Najam. Exactly. Ah, so in 2022, you know, uh, you left a bad test in 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 some people's mouths, you know. Yeah. Uh, after saying that uh, Zimbabweans mm -hmm. are resistant, are uh, resistant to to change, mm -hmm. and that is why the late Robert Mugabe ruled for 37 years. Mm -hmm. Cross cut. That's what he said. Was this a political statement? So, here's the thing, right? Pane is really inborn. Yeah. Right? So it's inborn because you are raised that way. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. I want it. I'm Gabi. I want it. This thing. Right? It's like a chimunzi. And I'm going to go to the house. Ah, I tend to go to the house. That is why we have this thing of. I'm going to go to the house. Ah, we should have done what I was doing. Yes. Yes. So with me, right? When I when I am saying things like that, because I I like to uh, psychologically uh, psychologically challenge 
provoke saying, you know what I mean? Because you see, that's what I'm saying. When I, when I do certain things, for me, it's, it's always it's, it's deliberate. You know, yeah. it's, 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 there's a method to my madness sometimes. You know what I mean? Like, so, what I was saying there, in, in actual sense, was like, Amana, Saga, are we never going to give chances to any, for example, there's hip hop now. Mm-hmm. There was never going to be hip hop in Zim. Zim, yeah, yeah. Let me, let me, let me, let me be honest to you. If lockdown didn't happen, mm-hmm. there was never going to be hip hop in Zim. Serious? Yeah. Why do you say so? When did uh, Zim uh, hip hop started trending? Yeah, that's around the same time. Around the same time, right? Mm-hmm. Why? Because everybody was at home, and it. Mm-hmm. So people were at home. And then just watching online, yeah. so entertain us online, yeah, exactly. Some brothers online, kind of whatever the scandals, whatever mm-hmm. things that's happening, yeah. You know, controversies that you're doing online, yeah. So it took away from the because in Zim is always like to 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 see, to measure your audience or to measure what you're doing is ah my live shows, yes. Chakale, 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 yes. Chakale, you know what I mean? Yes. So people started seeing ah, talk about the trend, about talk the internet, mm-hmm. who is entertaining us yes. on the internet, and so forth and so forth. Mm-hmm. Hip hop started trending more. And lockdown. Time. Oh. So for me, I'm like, so now and lockdown didn't happen. Hip hop engaged in this. Hip hop is really hip hop. Can't engage in this. Maybe time, time, maybe whatever. I'm not saying it was not going to happen mm. because I said uh, if, if 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 people would trust like someone on one of my tweets, I said to them, hip hop mm-hmm. is going to be the next best thing in Zim. Yeah. Now why I say that is because because Zim, Tatini kama kwa Tatini kama delay so. Mm-hmm. For example, I went to Zimbabwe and I was playing people on a Dibanj and exactly. a P-Square and a whatever. Back in the days, I think I remember the time I went to see I was with another rock. Mm-hmm. I was man, no, man, Nigerian music is the next best thing. Because mm-hmm. in 2011, that's what I'm Afro. Exactly. I've released in, in my album, um, in my album, uh, this is the movement. Uh, done a few Afro beats. Uh, mm-hmm. The reason also advantage was because I DJ Waxi yeah, and the yeah. guy who produced that album. Mm-hmm. I got produced uh, one of my hit songs, uh, Zanda Pezulu. The he's a Nigerian guy. Mm-hmm. I mean, he's a he's the one who produced for uh, Davido. Mm-hmm. He produced uh, yes, Davido, yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, all those most of Davido's uh, ah yeah, yeah mm-hmm. Davido hits. Yes, because he was with us here, oh. and then he moved to Nigeria. Oh, okay. And the time when he moved to Nigeria, he wanted us to move to Nigeria with him. Oh, so I don't know, but it was that you were going to be fired. Just today, so. Wasn't that it missed the opportunity? I don't know because I'd been to Nigeria so many times, and, 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 and I've told Nigeria almost like three, four. I've stayed in Nigeria almost like three months. Oh, so you go push music, yeah. Wow, she that's amazing. So I feel like it was a missed opportunity. <laughs> I don't know, but, <laughs> but it, was, it was going to be. But, but, but museum, uh, hip hop wise, mm. uh, how do you view these guys? You know, like say. Um, Holy Ten, Baga, mm. we've got the Saint Flo, we've got um, uh, are you Ashan? Mm. Yeah, these upcoming hip hop stars. Oh, yeah, no, 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 the, the, the movement is good. The, the, you know, it's, for me, that's always been my dream. You know, good young man, good machine as SA Atelier. And I'm yeah, yeah, T-Gons. yeah, yeah. Mm. So, I like that. You see, the only difference in Zim is like when SA is like SA was still. Tolerate other mm. genres. Oh yeah, you know it's, it's a broad market. Yeah, you know we know not on outer outer deep house. We don't want deep house. We got Zara. Yeah, you know you have uh, Black Coffee mm-hmm. who's doing uh, Afro Tech, who's yes. like, huge in that, mm-hmm. right? Um, this and Timo Mbaba Osama na Mbaba Osama. What's his name? Forgetting name. But I'm saying like you know um, you'd find out. In music, in a, in a listenership. Yeah. Like hip hop, no material. Yes, it's not as trendy as it was. Yeah. But on top of my piano, what you would hip hop. But with Danny, man, dance all is, we have to cue something to, exactly. to put something on. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yeah. now, when I go back to that, that mentality, I'm going to show you. I don't know if it's not going to be a why Why can't we just. Um, open up to all types of um, to just have a broad uh, mm-hmm. uh, mentality. Yeah, you know what I mean. So that is what uh, that is where I was going with that. With, 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 uh, oh, okay. You know, with that, with my, it's never for me. It's never an attack on my people. Oh yeah, it's always. I'm not. 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 I, but I don't, if you notice, it's always contract, uh, constructive criticism. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And he, it's, really, it's constructive because exactly. I want my people to. Yeah. So I'm like, but why am I, is my people, why can't we? Yeah. You know what I mean? Because 
Isoka fa ni hate at nungo hate and nungo hate mama artist nungo hate nothing for no reason. You know what I mean? And stuff like that. I'm like, yo, why? Because I still even don't understand why. But some artists, you know, they banish it. Yes. Like I said, I'm whiskey. I'm David. I mean, whiskey. David. We beef. We're organized. Exactly. 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 Skiri yeah. yeah. It's one thing that I always used to say. I always because we don't 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 miss a message. When we song, I don't know. When I'm gonna look at the go and comment, go exactly. and say something. Exactly. Ah, Jamal, you know I don't, I don't. So because it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not in him. Mm. But I still try to tell him to do it. Mm. I still yeah. trying to say, ah, miss song. Ah, you know, because why? I feel like sometimes you know you you still have to go into it because you know, look, I mean, look at international. Rihanna goes in That's sometimes true. fight with the fan. Uh, whiskey goes and what what they're doing a whiskey what what they're doing a what they're doing a banana what they're doing a banana what they're doing a fan by fan exactly that's why you know when the two guys the weed of a common section exactly the weed of a common section 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 I don't know what's being done. I don't know what's saying. You know why? Because I'm I'm calculative. We want to talk and we want to say that we want to learn. This is that it's going to get. But in the no no covering here. For the time time man. So no covering here because you see you see you see in the hood right. There's a way we react. Yeah. It's in every hood nigga. We want changa. We don't know what's going on. But it's just count here. So now we don't know. 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 Let's talk about let's talk about 2022. Mm. Um, you know, you sold your luxurious, uh, you know, Mustang to, to finance, um, fill up the National Sports Stadium. Yes. What happened to it? I didn't sell it. I said I was going to sell it. Okay. So here's the thing, right? I wanted to sell it, and that the I'm going to fill up, and which I'm still going to fill up the National mm. Sports Stadium. Mm. You know, I mean, the dream, the dream never, um, never dies out, man. Well, when do you think you want? You, See, so the, the thing with me is like I need to, uh, uh, like I I, I, I I keep saying that you see since you say see every in your, your all your actions and for now with and as you know I'm God God must must you have to have some sort of epiphany mm-hmm. on, in, in, in timing with okay for now with but you know the announcement for me yeah. was not that I'm doing it right now but I was engaging it mm. so the idea for me is. I want to the same things that I want to gather because remember to that, that to fill up the national sports stadium I mean the admin requires a bit of money oh yeah uh, quite a lot of money mm-hmm. and to to get it you know so for I'm trying to see if I can gather sponsorship I can do that and stuff mm-hmm. like that and, nice. and things like that mm-hmm. and for me like I said right when I said I want to fill up the national sports stadium it's like it's not a one man thing mm-hmm. you know I mean I'd spoken in Nitty Brown about that now we in case yes yes you know I spoke to Japanese about it I'd spoken to Holy mm-hmm. the time yeah I was like no Jens Judge manya ndagadala you know yeah. but when can I don't have got that number mm-hmm. I chose the damn team where is it let's, all, let's all enjoy the exactly. the you know share the, cake. the, the, the shake, thank you very much share exactly. the cake. so the the mission for me is still is still the plan still on, on. change because, because recently I saw you know prophet java mm. you know <laughs> he wanted to fill up the nation sports unfortunately So again in, in, in 2022 my brother you, mm. you you caused another stare on social media you know mm. uh, declaring that you are the richest Zimbabwean musician mm. yeah. and you said this in a court you said yeah. I'm the richest Zim artist out here um hate it or love it mm-hmm. um, no Zim Buffalo Z god even Batman video was 200,000 um, yes. runs budget yes. at the time and this uh, this man was equivalent to just over 10,000 US dollars mm-hmm. no what's your net worth my brother so for me you see net worth is always misunderstood mm. you know it could be in assets what do you have like you know, for example like a Mustang and a driver in there but it's about closer to a million you know yeah and uh, you know i mean the farms that we have with the family so because remember i'm in the family business and then our sister and we have a farm that we farm uh, livestock uh pretty much do everything fish farming everything yeah so pandiri nini ga do go nonge this na 5 million dollars my account but it's i have ongoing business oh yeah what, so, what, what 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 else do you do we do uh chicken uh chicken farming wow um 
Nema caravan, food, mm-hmm. food, food caravan. Okay. Um, That's big. And my sister and Junita. So in, with the family, with my sisters, we do uh, chicken farming. Mm-hmm. And then my other sister is into logistics. Mm-hmm. Uh, I went to my trucks. Okay. So I'm also involved a bit in there. Yes, yes. But um, so, plus, in music, I just used to say, royalties, I would say, I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. I'm sure. Every after three months, I receive maybe like 150K. Yeah, really? Yeah. Every way. every three months. Like three months. Hundred and fifty thousand. Yeah. From the stream. Cinema, yes. You see cinema. You see, because you see we, it's structured properly. Mm, let me show you something. Wow. It's structured it's structured properly because this is big, guys. Yeah. Oh. You see, that's that's the thing. Everybody thinks that you know find out that my life shows which is good as Yo. Mm. Yeah, I'm I'm sure. Yeah, that's the job. One hundred. If you look here, it's, on a, it's about eighty thousand. It's on a Jeez, that's real money. Royalties, yeah. Yeah. So that's real money. That's real money. So it's because you, you, when you structure, when you structure, see for here uh, registered with the publicist, mm-hmm. uh, publishing young, you know, the follow up on any. Any form of airplay, you know, mm-hmm. by, you know, would be. Yes. So I'm registered with Samro as well, you know, the South African musical, musical yes. rights, uh, and so forth. So they follow up with uh, with the royalties. Yes. So, where comes where's you got to say, "Panega my grandfather was Buddha." Mm-hmm. Like, like for example, like uh, the song that I did with um, with Nasty C was a Coke Studio song. Yeah. They paid us there, but they still pay us in royalties. Mm. Yeah. Right. Yeah. The one campaign song that I did, they, they paid us there, but they still pay us in royalties. Wow. Wow. So, but your stuff has to be registered. You have to have, you know, it's like even the, there could be songs, uh, music. And I was telling, uh, it was uh, Winky, I think I told you also, yeah, present. You yeah. Like, no. You'd find out sometimes maybe you're hanging in royalties mm-hmm. because you don't have a publisher, a publisher that, oh, that, that yeah. claims, that can go and claim Those, music. Uh, so, no, 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 my boss, I was my publisher. Yes. In, in, the record companies must, because there's royalties that come in different places. No, mm-hmm. no, electronic royalties. There's so many royalties that comes from the sales of the music, the streams. Yeah, yeah, my streams. Yeah, mm-hmm. um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, music. I'm going to dance. We're going to my clubs. Yeah. You know, so many things. There's so many places that royalties can come. Yeah. From. Which is good. And but I, I, are you aware that there are some other musicians who are rich out there? In oh yes, yes, yes. I, I am. But you are the richest. So no, no, no. You see, the thing is, this is the thing with me. Like, when I say that, mm-hmm. I was also staring up. <laughs> oh, I see. I was also staring up. Because I why? See. I see. Why don't we also have conversations like that? Mm-hmm. Why don't we also... You see, that's the thing. Like, you know, mm-hmm. <laughs> he's always... You know what I mean? So yes, that's yes, why sometimes I like what Holy does. Exactly. You know what I mean? Uh, I know that maybe sometimes it's harsh, it's mm-hmm. whatever, but, you know, it, the game needed that. It needs that. It needs because we... Exactly. You know what I mean? It's always like, ah, what's that? You know, because you need to go from breaking all the rules yeah, okay, from, yeah. from day one. You know, they have my video, I'm a girl. You know, what I'm about to say, this is a fellow reason. They have my video, I'm a girl. 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 No, because I'm a trendsetter. Uh-huh. It's just not to a bullet there, no chicken one. But it's not just a bullet there, no chicken one. So the idea, the concept with that, if you notice all those things, and they posted it right before my, all those, uh, you know, what do you call it? Uh, my, 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 my controversies are going to go. I'm going to find out. I'm going to find out my social media. Yes. I started all those things a long time. Way back. But anyway, um, above, um, rumors, you know, back, back then that says, you know, um, you are you and uh, Queen V are romantically involved. No, it shows them like that. So now, see, with Queen V, there was never a room of anything of that to even ever happen. Mm-hmm. Queen V from the get-go, I took her as my sister. Yes. Um, uh, her husband, mm-hmm. uh, I don't know if you know, her husband, Faramatsky. Yes. Me, yes. Me, me, me and him, anything that we were doing, mm-hmm. he was always there. Oh, yeah. Oh. So he's, he's never, because he's never, remember, he's not a guy that wants to be in there. Yes. He was never wanted to be. He's never, wanted, he does not have social media. Exactly. Not, you know, he's never wanted to be in front of anything. Mm-hmm. But he was always present mm-hmm. At all times, every time. Wow. wow. So there was no whatever. Even Yangu, Yangu studio, Yangu, he's always there. Mm-hmm. 
So there was never a whole um, ah okay Buffalo is now in a Queen V because I knew it would always it would always come because of the uh, the way the music would come out the way the things you know I mean my my pictures eh do kind of check I'm making my pictures and I'm making this so it would always come out, come out that way but Queen V has always been engaged in the movie market but wow. it's because it's, she was not pushing the whole oh I'm a married person I'm not she was just pushing herself being an art yes, as an artist yes. You know, so that's why all those those rumors, were, you know, were, I see. It was like, ah, but we just laugh. At then, in 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 <laughs> in um, August twenty twenty three, you became the second Zimbabwean, you know, after Prophet Passion Java to be on the Times Square, New York, um, digital billboard. No, 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 I was the first one. Yeah, the, you were the first one. I see the first. One. Okay, to be on so, that. So, okay, uh, let me explain, right? I'm actually the first one, and the second was Shasha, and the third was Prophet. Oh, so the first one, I started it. I was there with the one campaign. Mm -hmm. 2013, we were in the Times Square billboard. So, I mean, we were even in New York, and make us understand what's yeah. the logic or the meaning of being, you know, on that billboard. So, the Times Square billboard. Remember, that's the biggest marketing. If you notice, every music music hub, every um, it was almost like almost it's, it's a thing because record companies use Times time Square yes. to market mm -hmm. the movies. It's those bu the, the LED billboards yeah, yeah, yes, Times Square. Yes. So, it's a thing, you know. But, ah, my stuff is actually we actually advertising. Yes. We are actually there on the billboards. They go America. Remember. The, the pinnacle of t making it music is when you make it from America, yeah. you make it made it. Because I went to Jupiter and I went to Mars to make it, yeah. Yeah. To make it there. <laughs> but if you can make it there, it was sort of paid. Saka, the, hub, the biggest advertising hub platform mm -hmm. in the world is Times Square. Mm. So when you're there, you are there, you are amongst yeah. Yeah. The, the, you know, the, 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 the giants. The, the giants of, you know what I mean? So, when that happened for the first time, for me, it happened. That's what I'm saying. Like, I, I feel like most of my achievements mm -hmm. happened before social media was yes, really active. Yes. You know what I mean? I'm talking about there was a time when yes, social media. Yes, and those were, we were making moves. Yeah. We were making international moves. Ah, it's the times. But in the things that was that I never really looked at it. Ah, okay, this is this is huge. Mm -hmm. ah, look, I'm yeah, I'm in White yes, House. Yes, yes. It's only now when I when I when when uh, I go back and I'm like, yo, the same moves that I made, man. That's like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, because other people, uh, the uh, say artists, an artist now wants to do these type of moves, mm -hmm. right? For example, right, I'm going to Swaziland. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go to perform. You'll be, you'll be performing to there. Swaziland people. Okay. Right? Not Zimbabwean people in Swaziland. When our Zimbabwean people are going to perform, <laughs> they perform for, for Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe. Yeah, yeah. Right? I. Perform. I was in Nigeria. I was in Nigeria, I was in Nigeria mm -hmm. performing for Nigerians. Yes, I've done a three months tour in Nigeria, mm -hmm. performing for Nigerians. How did you right? manage to do that? So remember, remember, we came out at a time when it was still one feed. Oh, Just TV used to be one feed. One feed, yes. So Channel O was one feed. Mm -hmm. If I play, if you play my song, yeah, they're watching it in, in Togo, Nigeria, they're everywhere. It in Ghana, they're watching it in whatever. Yeah. So that's why even when I go to Nigeria, mm -hmm. I still tell the Nigerian artist that I was there before you. Boy. Exactly. That's oh. why when the beef happened with me and Banner Boy, oh. he was watching me on TV when, before he came here. Banner Boy. Yes, all of them. You know what so, I mean? So it was never. It so what was, was the beef thing. about with Banner? Oh, the Banner one was more. Of, so it was a uh, it was he was here. Uh -huh. So it was at uh, Dale's all white party. Oh yes, uh, there was an all white party that used to happen. It was a big all white mm -hmm. party, and uh, so for me, he, him in his def in his defense at that time was like, as I'm claiming to be the you know like the king of African dance. Mm -hmm. And I was talking, he said I was talking, I don't smack him, smack about him or whatever. I'm like okay, I don't understand because the, there was a v channel called Vuzu Channel, Vuzu TV on. on, on Who's entertainment? Yes. So they were interviewing all the nomi uh, the nominee uh, nominated people, mm -hmm. uh, and then they it's like yo, buff. Um, so what do you think about this year's nomination? The yes. nomination that I was telling you about that when I had quit. Yes. Uh, what do you think about all the other you know mm -hmm. people that are nominated against you? Artists that are just you know the dance artists. There was Shatawale. <laughs> there was Bernabo. There was Pato Ranking. Yes. Forgotten the other East Af East African artists mm -hmm. that was there. Then I was like, you know, to tell you the honest truth, right? All the other years, I've not felt so much heat mm -hmm. in terms of African dancehall yeah. artists in the same category yeah. like this year. Mm. So, but the only thing that I can live with, because me, I never thought, you know, you know, if, I was just like, the only thing I can live with now yes. for this thing is I've done it for 10 years consecutively. Mm. So I am king of African. Oh, dance. yeah. 
so, ten years consecutive. Yeah, ten years consecutive. I've been winning this award. Yeah. Won the, mm. You know, whatever you're doing, I've been winning that. Yes. So, you know, I mean, I'm, that is what I can use. I'm like, yo, mm. look. But now that these guys have, are here, mm-hmm. I respect what they're doing. I see what they're doing. But they must also just respect the king. Yeah, sure. So that's what all that, that type of talk uh-huh. that I did, I think it touched most of the gents. But it touched Bernard the most or something. Oh, right? yeah. So I remember when we were now at uh, Chanulo, uh, Chanulo was when we were racing, because uh, we were doing racing, they put me back to back with him. Bernard. Uh, with Bernard. So I was supposed, Bernard was supposed to, I was supposed to perform before Bernard. Mm-hmm. I think, yeah. I was performing before Bernard. So, you know, there was already t- some sort of tension, mm. you know? Um, I remember the, the, there was a st- thing that he had lost. He lost. He was coming from Cape Town yeah. and he lost his clothes. Oh, and they were asking me, "Oh, Buff, you know, you know people, man. You ah, yeah, yeah, the fashion rules. You exactly. know, I know anyway. Exactly. If you want, if you want uh, uh, feet, I can t- show you who to get the drip from. Exactly. So, but then I was asking the guy. So the the one producer of the of the channel was came to me. His name was Joby. Mm-hmm. He was asking me. I was like, Joby, but they're here. Why don't they ask me? Because they're standing here. I was like, okay, where they are, and I'm standing here. So <laughs> yes. we're just waiting to go do your research. Yes. So we're all yes. waiting here as artists to go and research. I'm like, but they can just come to me and ask me. <laughs> exactly. And, and Direct. Stuff, right? And then they didn't. I was like, okay, cool, whatever. And then I told Joby, well, let me hire my guy TC, you know? So after, and then we went to, uh, we did the rehearsal. So me, I always have this thing that I always do. I don't, I don't know if I should even say so you it. felt undermined somehow. Yeah, I was like, ah, it is what it is. Exactly. You know I mean? Because I uh, remember, I'm only, I only know of two songs of Ben at the time, Run My Race and mm. uh, Party. Yeah. So, uh, you know, and I, oh, no, 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 I actually knew the other song that he had called I Beg a Beg. Because uh-huh. he didn't know that when you, when I was in Nigeria, 2011, mm-hmm. DJ Humility came to me and Waxi with a CD. With a song, asking Waxy, can you play this guy? I mean, this guy, um, I'm one of the guy I'm pushing. Exactly. Right? Uh, so this song called I Beg, I Beg, you know? Uh, can you help us push this song? Mm. And stuff like that. And I was the one who was saying Waxy push the song because it was like a dancer song. So I was like, I was like, Ben a boy song. Have, yeah, I was like, you don't have a lot of dancer artists in, Jama- in Nigeria. Nigeria. So I like this guy vibe. Push this song, man. Mm-hmm. Type vibe. But anyway, that's fine. Then, then here, and then, then after, then after the, the whole uh, uh, rehearsal thing, you know, the whole tension. Was, me, when I'm rehearsing, I don't really show what I'm going to do in my performance. Yes. I just like, you know, play around. Mm-hmm. So he, he was doing his thing. Then they gave him like a king chair because mm-hmm. you know, you request what you want. Yeah, yeah. So he gave him like a, to be like a king in the chair and then he was going to sit him down and he was going to be doing all those things. Yeah. But me, I have my, I had my own thing that uh, I knew I was going to surprise the whole country. <laughs> so what I did was like on the day, I uh, sort of on the thing, I didn't re with, yes. with, with what I wanted to, mm-hmm. to do. unleash on the, you know, uh, as a surprise on the stage. So he was performing after me. Right? And this is also it. Mm. So I was performing um, uh, Baba Your Bums. Yes. Yes. So now I went on stage. As I get on stage, I went on stage, I was wearing a, ma- a mask. Mm-hmm. Full mask on. Yes. Get on stage, I stand and I take off the mask. When I take off the mask, <laughs> and then boom, song drops. I bring up five twerkers. Hey! I'm talking big twerkers. There's a photo of me like with a twerker jumping on me and I'm whining with the twerker. So the thing with me is like, let me, let me, let me explain, right? Eight o'clock yeah. is no more. So Channel used to show, that like, was this show from 8 p.m. and then it's no, it's no longer PG. Exactly. So I knew that the twerking is just starting in the country to train. Mm. It's a new thing. Yeah. But nobody's put the twerkers on TV yeah. or mainstream yeah. or whatever, whatever. If I bring girls coming in and twerking and whatever, yeah. I'm going to wrap this show regardless. Remember, I told you what I used to do. So you're very calculative, what, what, what I, you know. Yeah, remember, I told no, you what I, I used to do. What I used to do when I, when I used to go to events. I'm like, yeah, okay. This guy, who is they already trained. <laughs> yeah. They already have radio airplay. What am I going to do different? Exactly. But I'm telling you, back in the days with IRS, we used to go on stage with like a Tesla Petrol Mcano into my name in my light. Hey, oh, what is it? Yeah, exactly. So we can just do. Just how do we? How do we get the audience? Because. They don't really know who. Yeah, that's why I told the young boys, yes. young Lucio, throw money on stage. Exactly. Because they don't, you know, so you can capture them. <laughs> ah, yeah, we capture. <laughs> Strategizing. So we went there, boom. Ah, my trackers, we so did you like it? Ah, Babo, your bombs are good. Exactly. Why not my trackers? Ah, uh-huh. I stole the show up and I'm so much. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. She was like, she was like, was supposed to go in. He was supposed to go in, sit down and sing. Uh-huh. Ah, it was a dead card, boy. Hey. Nah, it was just. Yeah, I'm not going to the one time we meet at the club Montana, I don't want to have a I'm going 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 to
au wa party and the face za ziri za ziri hype hai and na queen v tina queen v my manager my manager on queen v manager in the gt or something uh-huh. Fizinda vai numa numa shure. Ah, ok. O do hoje. Agora, numa shure. Exato. Eu vou aqui with you. Ah. Não é bem a barulho, eu não jamo. Bom, do time agora nessa. Oh, oh yes. Eh. Ah, não, não puxa desse desse, não puxa o jiri mana. Tá, tá, não puxa bar, não, 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 de. Ah, time só, tá, tá, tá pass. So now. Tu tá um bruto, cara. Cura, puxa o gajo do dono. Ah. Ah, vai, 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 sumo, cara, vai. Ah. Swinging. Hey. Yeah. 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 I was just hitting going. What's 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 the reason that you say what's really happening? Like get up. I said but but it's fuck you fuck you. Fuck up and shit with you. So now the bouncer stopped to come. The stop and then uh, the ladies other guys come and then they grab me but grab me like I'm the one who's being vibe. Yeah. Like in the tanga fight. Now you don't go to some beri to go VIP. You see me say one bonanga na AK energy. So the drag is they take us to the back of the um, uh, one room that was at the back there uh-huh. and of course the party would happen like this so it was a big pool yes. and then there's like a papa kavaran but veranda but the uh, yeah. the main vip mm-hmm. and then they, you oversee the crowd hey. so now we go and then go back where what down down not come what's happening then they say yo blood you don't know your blood blood you don't know. so now i'm speaking i'm now speaking in pigeon i was like yo I'm gonna, just just speak pigeon uh-huh. cuz i can speak pigeon very well oh, you know, yeah. because of you know waxy and oh, yes. Nigerian people are, exactly. i speak pigeon fluently mm, nice so i'm like yo oh man man no man no start something but you know if you finish do this thing where they do yeah, bro, i'm from bricks on blood you don't even know that i'm from bricks on fuck your blood <laughs> <laughs> okay I don't get that visa is the visa team got to change. You got to go to pay the drive. You know, let's just do do, do it right now. Don't <laughs> so you know from this one. I'm like, bro, stop jumping, stop being froggy. So I'm telling the bro, you know because you jump, 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 don't be froggy, brother. You know? It's like, bro. Now, so we move uh from there and the movers they they, they, they move me actually. Exactly. They move me. Mm. I'm about to got to go. I mean, no I want to go. Mm. So like, bro, this one where you start, now you go finish. Huh? So I'm say, you know. So I leave Then I call, I call Liz. Mm-hmm. Liz doesn't answer his phone. Mm-hmm. I call um, this other guy called uh, D. That time he was mm-hmm. part of the Liz manager. Yeah. Like, Yo, Jens, I send them a message. I was like, Jens, I've been trying to call you niggas. You let me disrespect this dude. Oh yeah. And you just gonna let it go. Yeah. And then now, but Twitter and the Bavara one, Bavara one, Jawa. Hey, na 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 Gang yeah. gang. She got a party by by and in the 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 lizard room but the lizard we you know we we, we even stop talking for a minute and, and me and AKA stopped there was always there was tension. Yeah. Gung gung gents came out guns I said to the 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 one with team we guns blazing. Hey. So now the homies man. come the homies come now You need to this is go downtown guys we do go team team do mazimba we do exactly go that exactly the banning face of the inzira so shoot was so the one of the guy was so he was also hectic he was actually he was the most scariest guy I don't know net so you feel I'm going to go say some face and matapile and this kind of thing like but they were all there no people banning bonds bonds was one of the kids that used to one of the gunmen that is I found banana fanonga young nucho cuz he was a gunman guy oh yeah yeah so now team are we my bear papa kaka Food by the way, pa 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 denga pa tita. People start dispersing. People start dispersing, dispersing. Pa pa ji. Now get inside and look for banana. Banana, find a banana. Look for banana. So I told them, no, I just want banana. I mean, I don't want anything to do with it. I just want banana. Banana. So me and him can can handle. Because you guys, oh. you know, you want to do. Let me just me me and him handle. Ah, ba tiga muna muna ab. That is it. Police voice. Hey, police voice. Re- uh, reaction. What what what? Team rang for a spread the party. Police are very kind. Ah, you making noise? I don't know. I'm making noise. I'm just saying. Exactly. The one the one who's been pushed around. Exactly. As you can see. Police don't see any case on me. Exactly. He's advertising a show at club Taboo. Mm. Uh, South Africa. Yeah, I think the same and there was the, second night or third there night. That was a bad move. Yeah, second night or third night. I posted a solo. Uh, uh, what's it? Um, what's it called? A Mark 10. Uh, yeah. I posted a Mark 10. One of my guy came with the Mac 10. I posted the Mac 10 on Instagram. I was like, yo, I'll see you tonight. I pull up with my guys. Like like, I, 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 added, I added more muscle. Yeah, I, yeah, came yeah. Up, I came up with this other Congolese guy. He's a Congolese guy, man. Because <laughs> yeah. Patrick, so he's, a, he's, a, he's hectic. Yeah. I added up the more muscle. 
now we we we, we he comes in he arrives with the, with the Rolls Royce. Yes. So, about to perform. Yeah, as he, as he pull up, because uh, uh, they had a nice drive by, taboo uh, drive by that you can actually exactly. drive in and stand. And then the, there's a red carpeted club. Yes. They pull up there, and I'm standing there with goon goons. They pull up. They can't come out of the car. Oh, I come out. I know, I know. May come out now. So him now. He's like, no, 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 let me, let me come out. May I speak to him? Uh, now he's speaking PG. Like, exactly. no, now he's speaking PG, my dog. May talk. Come out. May talk now. Now he wants to talk to it you. It was a big. Um, then the war went on for a while until Waxy later on came because me and Waxy had stopped talking mm. at some point. Then Waxy came back and Waxy was in, I think it was in Nigeria or mm -hmm. the UK or something. So he came back. Canada thing. Yeah. yeah. He came back and he was like, no, Buff, let's squash this thing. And let's, then he, he started speaking to other team and mm -hmm. speaking. And there was a guy called also, um, West Africa. Mm. He's, 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 he's on Instagram, is West African Prince. Yes. He's, uh, he moves with Davido and the guy is there in the uh, same clique. Yes. He, he, him, I knew when I was still staying at my sister's house. He used to have a saloon. Mm -hmm. So he's like, ah, buff, what's going on with all this? I'm like, yo, <laughs> bro, they just provoked it. Like, exactly. Yeah, just sleeping. Exactly. <laughs> you know I mean, I just provoked They started the war. Him. And yeah. then, then they started, and then they called him. Then, uh, you know, we started to have uh, some sort of meeting. Let's squash this thing. So with their gang and then da da da. And then, uh, there was a guy called, uh, LHF, he was closer to Benabo. LHF used to actually stay in my east complex. I used to stay that time. Oh, yeah. So he's like, yo, Buff, let's meet him and let's talk. Then we did a whole video call with Benham. Mm -hmm. So we started squashing and then we squashed everything. And we were cool. And then mm -hmm. Benham was supposed to come for the that event that they cut and oh, we yeah. started beefing with the AK online. Mm -hmm. uh, it was an arts and culture thing in Pretoria thing. Oh, yeah. So he was supposed to come. So that time we were planning, like, if he comes, mm. then maybe we can, you know, we'll we'll support. Do a collab or whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. But then we squashed it. Mm -hmm. You know, and then but, you, but, but are you cool now? Ah, we cool. Ben, are you, ah, we you cool. guys talk now? No, no, no. We don't. We don't. Ah, we ah, chat about it because we are Levels. Ah, we release. Ah, we release. So the, the only time I can uh, I managed to speak to him at the time was through this guy, um, LHF. Mm -hmm. So LHF would, uh, you know, would call and we'd be together and then you know we'd speak to the guy. Yes. But, uh, one on one, whenever. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Wow. That's very, mm. very interesting. You yeah. know what? As, as, as we conclude this uh, very interesting conversation, I won't <laughs> yeah. want to end this, but anyways, yeah. it was at the time. But yeah. um, uh, any other projects, uh, you know, any other upcoming projects um, with the local or maybe international artists mm. that, that, that are like, so like, like, um, line, lined so, up? So last year I was supposed to drop an album, then I didn't. And uh, so this year I'm going to definitely drop something. I dropped an album. Um, the last album I dropped was the Unity album. Oh, yeah. Uh, which is on online. I don't know if most people listen to it, but yes, uh, since we are on Ola, I have a team can... Go back you know? and listen to the, uh, that um, album, yeah. It was, a, it, was actually a um, it was actually like a, one of my, I feel like, my best projects. Yeah. But um, yeah, I'm working on something new. Mm -hmm. uh, there'll probably be features, you know what I mean? Zim, yeah. International. Yeah. We'll see how it goes. Mm -hmm. uh, but I'm trying to just do... Uh, for Buffalo Soldiers, so I can just like just do some Buffalo Soldier. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So, because I always feel like people don't really, people haven't really heard a Buffalo Soldier. Like, yes. okay, can I want to hear his board of work? Mm -hmm. you True. You know what I mean? But you hear someone who go in the comments and say, mm -hmm. but I said, I'm going to a unit yes. album. Yes. I said, I'm going to be, I have 10 albums. Mm -hmm. Nobody's really, you, you, because I always feel like, and I come from, um, I'm not going to say anything to all before, and, and it's an effect. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I don't think anybody should comment. If you don't affect, yeah, better shut up. Yeah, because if you don't have comments, Chango no boss Google is cool. So phone up, up, up. Just check. I was one that library. Then I library with that. Exactly. Just like encyclopedia. Exactly. Just just check there on your phone. <laughs> Whenever about Google, okay, okay, just a moment. Okay, okay, let me just listen. And then then you know we like a survey go. Exactly. Like, ah, and from what I heard, I'm just like, ah, you know, and then you can talk from there, you know. Yeah. So that's what. Um, that's the same thing that happened when people even were even judging me with the whole shut up, beef. And not knowing the Susan Shatawale, we cooked it. Yeah, yeah. So me and Shatawale only cooked it because we were like, yo, let's do, let's push dancehall mm -hmm. because of the Western. Oh, in the yes, South. yes. It's, yes. it's quiet. I see. What can we do? Mm -hmm. Let's because Shatawale is a businessman. That yeah. guy is, is a, you know, he's also here, you know, it's not, yes. like, buff, let's do this thing. Yeah. I mean, we, you know, we did this whole thing, you know, like, we're laughing, you know, like, you know, because our idea was uh -huh. we do it mm -hmm. and then we do, um, what do you call it? Then we do like a concert. Oh, sting. a big one. Yeah, sting, you know, but we bring in other artists. Yes, yes. You know? But, uh, you know, people miss, you know, 
Wangu wangu kutora masalo da baba upudi siko wangu wala shata wale si this is me shata wale ah ah yeah me me shata da ano wana pesa wangu what do you think about that song ah yeah this one is fine but this one you know yeah but the thing is was we wanted to cook it because we wanted to stay uh, noise in the in, in, in the genre in, in Africa. Oh, oh that was quite. Let's do that so when you do then we can do a Ghana exactly. uh, event yeah. and we can also do a Zim it event and we can yeah. you can see how we can find a central ground big. to do this thing. That was the whole idea. Um no speaking to so, so many other promo, uh, sponsors that would jump on yeah. it. So guys, let's let's do this thing and, and, exactly. and so forth and, and so forth. And I even spoke to Winky at the time. I was like, exactly. oh Uh, German, do you think you can jump on and do a this song? Then we like, ah, but for now we can't like two, two, no good vision. Exactly. Jagamira Z. It's calculative, you know. Exactly. exactly. Like, There's so many. Uh, I, pre- I, pre- I present so many things to him. Mm-hmm. You know, I mean, he also presents some things to me. Yes. Yeah. And um, and uh, it's always been the, you know, like okay, I met one of you. Yeah. So from there, any brand language, any language, any what I'm doing, what I'm doing for doing for now or not. Mm-hmm. So do para para so not the conversation we have with. Instead of backing me up, I would go attack. I won't do. You made me team up with that. I would go attack. So you know what causes that? It's caused by my followers, the young man artists. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to feel like. Yeah, I'm not going to feel like. No, I'm not going to feel like. I'm not going to do it. If I'm going to do, we support a, we support a mess. We support a Ronaldo. Ah, but then Ronaldo, they are the same. They are the same. But Ronaldo, but when I'm messing with Ronaldo, I know both. Both are the same. But when we are, we support Ronaldo. Ah, but Ronaldo, they are the same. Exactly. I'm not going to do that. You know, so. It was always that type of um, uh, thing, and then to me, I'm, ch- I'm trying to hint, guys. No, man, just support, just see what we're trying to do first. And uh, we started getting other art- artists also to come on, jump oh, on the yeah. beat, because the idea was we wanted to grow the whole thing. But you know, we uh, understand. Do you remember when I said that I was too cold for that one? And you know that it's the funny funny enough, you know, that that beef brought in. Do you remember when I said that I was too cold for that one? Oh yes. Mm. <laughs> that's how that's when he that's when he came out yeah because he came out as he as he a defending song that was his first trending eh babalo so you know what you try to yeah okay when you know, that's, yeah that's when he that's when he came out and then he started you know so we see what what, what what i'm saying is like it could have opened up yeah Uh, but I mean, that's always been the mission. I mean, trying to, to also help put, uh, put the guys on uh, international platform. You know what? It's been uh, yeah. quite a pleasure, you know, hosting yeah. you, my brother, here in uh, in South Africa. Yeah. But before before we shut it down, maybe a freestyle. Freestyle. Yeah, you know, your four, your fans, you know, <laughs> those are watching right now. You know, yeah, like, hey, drop something, man. Yeah, man. Let's do something. Yeah, man. Okay, so I'm gonna just do it's just for my, for my, for my song, right? There's a message as well. Mm-hmm. From you are made from flesh and blood. No man a bigger than God. Them a fan of the whole of them boy, them a fraud. Yo. No man a bigger than God. Me. You are not God. You are not God. Again. No man a bigger than God. You are not God. You are not God. Yeah. No man a bigger than God. Yeah, I don't know. It's Buffalo Soldier. It's been a pleasure. Let's do a little bit of something. But, uh, Yeah, man, it is what it is. It is what it is. I like that. And how can people follow you, uh, my brother? How can people get in touch with you? Yeah, man. Oh, always on social media. Mm-hmm. Uh, always on Instagram. Mm-hmm. Uh, like I said, now man, I'm gonna pin and drop in, dude. Exactly. You know, I, I respond uh, if you DM me. I respond. Um, the comment section, footy. Two can do two cow. Say something nice. I don't you start know. a war with the yeah, with, yeah. with with this guy, Buffalo Soldier. Yeah, yeah, I mean, uh, you you just call the, the guys energy. to come and do do the dribbler dribbler. Yeah, the energy is is, is super cool. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, I, I feed, I give what you what you, what you know. <laughs> so, my brother, I will see you in Zim when you come. Yeah, man, definitely, brother. Yeah. Thank you for having we'll see me. See you in Zim, thank Zim. You, thank thank you. you so much for you know for, for honoring our invite. It was, you know? was fun. Thanks, man. I, I I actually feel that it was short, man. But it need, it need to the uh, whole day. Two hours, yeah, <laughs> yeah oh, maybe five hours. Yeah. So much, of, so much, of course, so much. Uh, same man exactly. uh, but I haven't done also I haven't done a podcast so, yes yeah, so. yes yeah so this is the first right yeah, yeah which is which is good yeah. he's a good one thank you so much that was uh, my brother here uh, yeah. Buffalo Soldier so don't forget to follow him on his social media handles at Buffalo Soldier uh, on Instagram Twitter everything and you know what guys it's been a pleasure and uh, we're going to give you more more in more and more interviews here in South Africa like I say and you know what guess what we are not just stopping in South Africa We're moving from South Africa to Botswana, uh, Namibia, uh, Kenya, Tanzania, and Zambia. So, podcast yevanu, podcast yenyika. 
taking your podcast to the world. Thank you so much. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Every dollar sent home from the diaspora by your loved ones represents their hard work and commitment to ensuring that you're all taken care of. That's why we want to ease their experience and make it more convenient. With Sasai Money Transfer, sending money from the diaspora is free and you receive the money straight into your EcoCash USD wallet, ready for you to spend and cash out for free. That way, you can receive money to help you alleviate the impact of the drought on you and your family, buy groceries, pay school fees, renew your insurance, pay bills, and more within a few taps on your phone. And you're guaranteed access to USD cash from any registered EcoCash outlet nationwide. Tell your family in the diaspora to send money with Sasai Money Transfer today. Let's fight the El Nino-induced drought together. EcoCash. Live life the EcoCash way. It's the little things that make us giants in our industry. We put in that extra mile of service so your car can go that extra mile of performance. Our aim is to make our stopovers feel like home. Giant Petroleum. Limitless Energy.